Okay. That's why no one was replying because I was like, oh, talking. Are we streaming now? We aren't. I just. I thought we were streaming. Well, I got a I got a notification of streaming at eleven fifty three. It maybe it like Twitch. quit itself or something. But now now it is. Cause we were talking to y'all, sweet low Leander, I see dead clowns. Yeah, we were Demon <laughs> Slayer. That was weird. Yeah. I think maybe I clicked something and it was still it went off. on the button, and so I accidentally clicked the button twice, maybe. Yeah, I was like talking to Demon Slayer, and I see dead okay. clowns, sweet old Leander. Let's, what's let's up? Let's do this as AG an example. 5, what's let's up? say I draw these three. We're just trying Pick to figure a out my tactic battle tactic in your tactic, hand and place know? it face down separately. The information is still hidden from your opponent, but make it clear which card is separate. The card stayed separate until you use the command on it or score the battle tactic. Okay, so for example, let's say I want to do this redeploy yeah, in the we're... enemy movement phase. Because I'm moving and you say, no, I'm moving out yeah, so, to make it harder. When you use the command on that card, it is not discarded but returns to your hand. Your opponent can check the information on it before it returns to you. The card goes back to being a normal battle tactic card with the exception that you cannot use the command on it in the same phase. In the same phase, it went back into your hand. Phases phase, are turn. different. Yeah. yeah. So you can you it's basically allowing you, you to use a command twice because you could say, "All right, I'm doing this." And then it comes back to my hand. But then, let's say turn two, you keep that card yeah. again. And then you're like, I'm I'm doing this. Or you choose not to do it and you can score it. Essentially, later. it has to be a different turn. Because each yeah. thing is in a – because each card specifies a phase. Yeah. So if you can't use it in the same phase, that means, yeah, you'd have to use it. And it doesn't specify – here's the confusing part. It doesn't specify in these rules, even though it's very long <laughs> – it's when it very returns to your hand, to word. me, that means you can still score it at the end of the That's what I thought. Thing. I thought that's what but the But the wording was. is like, if you did not, not use yeah. the command, then you can yeah. score it. Yeah. But no, it's just telling you if it's still face down at the end and you did not use it, you can it's still, still score, score it. it. It's trying to tell you, yeah. pick your card back up and score it if you want. But once it goes back to your hand, it follows all the same normal rules, which you can score it at the end, too. Okay. Okay. So, now we get it. So I, but I only still have three oh, those cards. Are mine. <clears throat> I only still only have three cards. You still only. Have I don't. I don't. Three cards. Draw yeah. three and then have one aside. Mm, well, what does it say? I didn't read that part. It says pick a bio tactic in Tork your off, hand. covered in oil. Joe or Alex? Uh, to easily. <laughs> um, I feel like Joe. I feel like Alex. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah, because if you can actually get Joe. Alex to do that, then <laughs> it's such a uh, a win that he wins by default because he'll never do it. Joe, you might be able to convince to do he, it. Yeah, exactly. He'd, he'd, he'd be into it. That's what I thought. I was like, man, he'd be way too <laughs> Slap into it. Slap Sk Skolski. Thank you, man, for coming. Hey, man, Incubus, I saw you said you had your Browns gear on, man. You got to get out of here with that, man. You got your Browns gear? Who said it? Incubus. Incubus, type something, you motherfucker. Oh, shit. You're going to kick our ass today. The King Cobra of Vengeance. Wow. <laughs> Ten tier one subs to the community. Thank you. Thank you so much. That's amazing. That is so awesome. Got to support Joe wherever I can. Hey. Whenever I can, he said. Big. Big thanks. Big smiles all around. Big you ups, just, bro. You just made my Sunday. Nice. Uh, with ten. Because even if the Cowboys lose, because <laughs> we are. We're Number headed, two defense we're going against. Yeah, so We're headed for a loss, for uh, sure. I put money on. I betted my friend like 10 bucks against the Browns, so. I didn't know they and had the number two defense, yeah, though. Yeah, well, you're about to lose $10. <laughs> All right. Uh, you want to grab two brewskis over there? Yeah. Um, yeah, it just says pick a battle tactic card in your hand, so mm. it would just be one out of my hand. Yeah. All right. All right, so uh, let's see. All right, so twist card comes first the twist card today you know what I should probably have a K 
Ham on this screen. Lord Jebediah, we, we hope for a good game, too. Jebediah, Jebediah. He said, I want you to know Fantasy I'm Brad's I had the Browns defense and Prescott. I don't know if I should play Prescott or not. No. Do not play Prescott. <laughs> Brain. Do you have a better option? Yeah, who's your other who's your or quarterback, Brain? Do not, I repeat, do not <laughs> play Prescott. I have been a Cowboys fan for 30 years. <laughs> please, please listen to what I'm saying. I just 30 years, to, 40 yeah. years. I don't know how many years. Joe and I were just talking about like how he just got paid, but I'm like, but Joe made up a good point. It's like, after people get paid, they really after don't do. After people get paid, they do terribly. Yeah, most of them at least. Yeah. So, we'll see, I guess. Caleb Williams. Oh, the Caleb Williams. See, that's tough because that's the rookie, Caleb Williams. So, uh, you don't really know how, how well he's going to do it. Caleb that's, Williams? Yeah, I think. Is his other? It's uh, who is I he's a rookie, he's, I think. Oh, is he a rookie for Chicago? For Chicago? Yeah. Try to give it a read that or is it too blurry? These dice cams I've always been suspect on. Wish I could get them better. Wish I could get my dice cams better. Whoops. I don't wanna fuck that up. Diggs, I think Diggs going to do good, man. He He's not going to be double covered every time because he has, like, four other wide receivers around him that are very good. Yeah. Jaden Daniels is the other quarterback I picked up. That's a rookie. That's the Washington. Yeah, Caleb Williams is the Chicago. Bro, I, Brain, I almost say Caleb Williams, man. I would trust a crapshoot of a rookie – over the crap of deck. <laughs> yeah. Bless you. <clears throat> Bless. You. Thank you. What is this stars and stripes? Who bought this one? Oh, it's Yangling. Yeah. That must be uh, Patrick that bought it. There. I definitely. I think it was either me or. I thought it was stars. I, I think somebody bought the stars and stripes, but stars and stripes is. Yeah, it's Yangling. Team RWB, Team Red, White, and Blue. Hmm. They give their money to veterans. Oh, Trayvon Diggs. Oof. Yes. Well, I mean, kind of he has to do good because fucking Bland is out. So, Trayvon, that's, it was kind of the story last year that uh, Bland stepped up for Trayvon. Now, Trayvon's going to need to step up for Bland. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Because now Bland's hurt. Trayvon so Diggs. We need, hit, we need him to do well. Yeah, Bland's hurt. That's right. Trayvon. Yeah. Bland stepped up last year. So now Trayvon needs to step Damn. up this year. Pick up Damn, the slack. Man. If we had, if we had Bland. Both in, of them? Yeah. That sucks if we, uh, one more one year, really, we yeah, yeah. still do not get to have both of these guys on yeah. the field. I hate it. Yeah. It really All makes right. a difference. Let me set up my forces. And, and, Patrick, I think today I want to try a a very structured style to where it would make editing battle reports a lot easier. Uh, and maybe we'll do an example where you'll edit this one, even though I may not use it. Or maybe I will because yeah. it's been a while since I put this on. All right. But Thanks first, let Cooper. me set up my forces. You're welcome, Incubus, for Cooper. Oh, yeah, Amari Cooper. <laughs> I always thought he was better than, than the Cowboys gave him credit yeah. for, but sometimes people just don't do well in certain places. Yeah, and, like, and then once, they, and then once they wake CD up. Came, came in and, like, Cooper started feeling like he was getting yeah. less and less touches, I feel like Cooper wanted out, too. It'll be all right. We'll see. It'll be a good game, hopefully. The show we were watching earlier had him losing by one point. But I, <laughs> Joe thinks they'll lose by at least a touchdown. Oh, I think they'll lose by 10 points. 10 points, that's right.
Can't wait for Chubb to return. He, dude, he went really late in my big money draft. He went like round 10 or 11. You, you just don't know if a player is going to come back after a big injury like that. Be it as explosive, especially running back. They're always getting hit. You're a Baker boy, Mayfield. You got a Chubb. You got a Chubb right now. Chubb jersey on right now. <laughs> well, I hope he does well because um, I love making fantasy football pun uh, names for my teams. And I have Chubb. A Chubb is the uh, Chubb. <laughs> are my Chubbs is small. Uh, Your Chubbs is small. That, that was one of my team names. I love having Chubb on my team. You should be There's Chubb so, is big. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's not fun if it's big, though. No. It's more funny if it's small. Cover. For the see. comedy purposes. He's out for three more weeks. Okay. Yeah, I knew last season was a big injury for him. Yeah, it was bad. at my uh, one of my regiment abilities my handsomeness Sexy Vampirilla is coming back. Nice. Oh, yeah. She's going to be my vampire leading. Oh, loud. She has like the uh, Borat swimsuit on. Yeah, she does. <laughs> Okay, I think I'm set up. Got my regiment ability picked. I just went through these enhancements. The Saints don't get the first touchdown of the NFL season. Brain Eclipse. There was the Chiefs and Ravens already played. played yeah, that it was Xavier Worthy the first guy to score. I don't know, maybe. He was he was definitely the first Kansas City guy to score. Yeah, there was a game before the Ravens and Chiefs, wasn't there? It's on Thursday night. I don't know. I think that was, the, that Thursday, was the Thursday Thursday night, Thursday night game, and then Green Bay and somebody played in Brazil on Friday. Okay, who won? Did the Eagles win or lose? Uh, did they win? I don't even know. It's a good Come question. Come on, they're in our fucking division. <laughs> we should both know this. I know. Don't tell me Philly started one and zero. God damn it! I can't read yeah. your name by the Philly way. Anybody one. has dark blue? I can't read their it's name. It's incubus. He says he's wearing a motherfucker. Brown. <laughs> that's the inc. That's the Browns jersey. Yeah, guy. that's the Browns jersey. Incubus. <laughs> How do you get your name? Really do you? It? You don't choose your own color, do you? I think you I do. Years first for down. <laughs> What's up? You ready for some football? First yeah. one down. Oh Let's no! Go. First one down. First that could mean anything. <laughs> first, you and the you and the football mood though. Yeah. yeah. The football mood. 
Honestly, we probably should have played some Blood Bowl because I, I oh, have too new many God, factions. That's such a good idea, bro. Uh, we'll, we'll have to do next it next week. time. Because yeah. uh, I have two new factions. I've got uh, the Amazons, which I want to play, yeah. and I've got Gnomes. So gnomes. two brand new teams. They just recently revealed the Chaos Dwarves. Still no Kemri. I really want Kemri. Is the Tomb Kings, like okay. the mummies walking around. Nice. So... Once they, I, I think we'll do Blood Bowl in, uh, next Sunday, chat. Me and uh, me and Patrick here. So it's Kansas City. See, Incubus, how did you change that? It was Green Bay and Philly. So you That's can who. change the color? Green Bay and Philly was the Friday game. And then. Oh, Bal you can go even darker red. Baltimore, Kansas was Thursday. So Baltimore, Kansas, Thursday. Baltimore, Kansas. And then Green Bay, Green Bay Philly, Philly on Friday and Friday. Philly. And was there a third game or no? No, and then just this, two games. And then today, today's games. Yeah, and then Philly, twenty-nine to thirty-four. It was close. Because that's when Jordan Love got hurt. It was on his last drive, and he was like trying. Jordan to, Love's hurt. Yeah, because he was. Is he out? Yeah, that's what I was telling He's you. My for how long? quarterback, because I was saying the MCL, three to five, three to five weeks. Because it was on the Three last. Three to five weeks. Yeah, it was um, like the last two minutes I of the hate game, the bro. the Packers, but I don't care until they're in the playoffs. Yeah. So I feel bad. Yeah. They said, and well, and then they're, and they're in Brazil, too. So they had to fly all the way to Brazil to Wisconsin to get the MRI done. Oh, my God. Yeah. Everybody's on, like, NFL Circle Jerk has, like, uh, they're like Jordan Love after his Brazilian MCL, and then they have him, like, with the Brazilian uh, butt lift thing. <laughs> like, it's <big>. yeah. <laughs> it's like he's going to come back with him. <laughs> they said they ruled out an ankle. The, the, the um, initial report said they ruled out an ankle and was getting an MRI on his knee. I've been doing deep research on this, y'all. I'm freaking out. Season ended already in the first game. No, it'll be, right. it'll be all right. Hopefully. It looked it looked like he rolled his ankle. It really did look. I thought it was his ankle too. Yeah. But so does that? Uh, that looks blurry, doesn't it? A little bit. Yeah. So I think I just need to manually focus. Focus, and I. F it's something I I keep I never thought about before, because I'm I keep having to zoom in. I don't want to. I want to set this once. Oh, I just got 51% over o OJ. It's 51% projected now. It's still really early in the game, though. Chat, I'm playing OJ this week in fantasy. So next time y'all see it, OJ in chat, you let him know that I said that he has no chance. He was the first one to show me that the ESPN had taunts on it because he sent me a little taunt. So all right. Just did for that, that focus at all? Yeah, I feel like that's better. I feel like that's better. Yeah, definitely. That going to be the MVP. The MVP of the shit show, he will be. 49ers have always been the bane of our existence. Fucking Purdy. They, Dak did get paid, which means he probably will throw even more interceptions. Even the fucking... Commercial he's in, he's fumbling shit. We just saw that commercial. It's fucking dropping everything. Dak is mid. You're right. We should not have paid for him. Now our salary cap is all fucked, I think. Yeah, he's, yeah, he's mid. All right. And I have all my, my regiment and enhancements picked, too. They have some pretty good enhancements. He has like a a reinforce enhancement. Well, I guess I already have that with the soldiers.
Yeah, Deshaun Watson is not. Since this is kind of like, you know, me and Patrick's stream, we're just kind of, you know, the, our first stream, our first uh, football season yeah, stream, yeah, basically. Yeah. Oh, we're, we're just taking it easy. I'm trying to figure out how to make it easier for Patrick to edit, edit uh, videos. Do you currently have any USBs? Yeah. Out, but it's like at your house, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, so I was. So one of the things I think is trying to make it easy. So basically, I oh, the flash. Drive. Yeah, the flash drive. You're you have a flash drive? I think it's at the house. I don't. I don't remember if I gave it to you. If I, I don't remember. Yeah, I don't remember. You, so look forward at your house. Yeah. See if you yeah, have yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. But I think. Uh, so. I wanted to to structure the battle report editing. So there's the intro scene, there's the army lists, there's the priority role I want to get on camera, there's the deployment. And so that's what I think this will be. You can do the deployment one. screen. Okay. And in fact, we can combine the priority role with the deployment screen. Well, not for Spearhead. It's going to yeah. have to be game dependent because Spearhead, you roll and then you set up. Yeah, and so you can't really so get the just, roll yeah, on there. It depends on um, order. And then there's turn one summary, turn uh, four, and then it's basically per game because Spearhead has four turns. The main game has five turns. Yeah. Uh, Conquest has eight turns. Yeah, that one had a lot of turns. <laughs> yeah, post and then a post game summary and then an end scene. But for Spearhead, you know, I'm curious if I even need to do this handheld thing. Um, and I think I think I, I should. Yeah. Uh, see how because I was gonna see how it looks. I was gonna see, you know, how well. Let's mm, let's try it both ways since we're just you know are we gonna do a watch stream for Cowboys versus Browns? You know we never we never considered yeah, that. Yeah, that's, that's something we've never considered. Could I, I was just I might, thinking about the NFL, like the is it how? What's so we the can't do that. Yeah. But what you could do is you could put a webcam on us. Uh, okay. Okay. And then I can even create a template where it keeps like the score. Maybe we can find an app or something that does do a lot without yeah. visuals. Yeah. It shows, you know, fucking score, down, maybe the last oh. four plays. Because. That would be fun, You know, though. our friends. It, I, I don't. But here's the thing is I don't want to make everything work. <laughs> yeah. You know? Yeah. And what if one of my friends, because we have friends over all the time. What if one of my friends says something inappropriate? Yeah. You know, that, that could get us canceled. Yeah. <laughs> uh, Maybe maybe like for what a special one, of my one time special say something thing. inappropriate. Yeah, it could be it, it could be a special thing, but then if you want a special thing, then it wants to be a playoffs and then it's like I don't want to be watched during playoffs. <laughs> you know, cuz then there's definitely some inappropriate uh, things that, that'll yeah. go on if we if we're losing. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I feel like if if we everybody It might be it, it might be something that we can try, yeah. but well, even the even the boys were like, "Are you gonna are we gonna stream the draft?" And I was like, "I was like, oh, like so everybody." Seems oh, that would have been cool. Yeah, but uh, nobody brought nobody brought it seriously up with me. Yeah, they had to sit me down and be like, "Joe, do you, can yeah, we yeah. can we?" Because then I would take it serious. It was just because like, we put together the draft. Like, I had like five minutes yeah. of prep because I was doing something else. I think it we was like streaming. streaming. Yeah, because yeah. we were streaming. I had to like run to the bathroom, yeah. run and get food. Yeah. Dallas does suck this year. <laughs> that doesn't bother us. Yeah, John. Football today. We're gonna do a, a game of Spearhead, and then. Uh, yeah. So we stop. We stop the stream at like three or sooner, depending on on how what we get done. Because uh, I'm using this as a, you know, a, a, test. a test stream for future streams. Okay. Well, let's let's get let's get this done. So I'm going to hit the uh, record button here. Yes, sir. Um, so, hmm. 
our army lists. Okay, so this is how it would go. We would go, uh, we would start the show, uh, and we would be on chat subs, and then we would do the count. <laughs> k at the top so then i would need to change that or i could go directly into you know uh this screen i'll go directly into this screen even though and then that one also says warhammer i need to render one here can you text me uh render a screen render a battle reports template without the Warhammer 40,000 logo. So I could stick Age of Sigmar there. Render battle report template. Well, yeah, render, render battle report template without Warhammer 40,000 logo. Cool. Okay. And I got your text earlier, and I started looking. I couldn't find a good sound, so it's like, now I need to find video games that have the good sounds. Oh, uh, the one I sent last time to you? Yeah, yeah, we were trying. Number one, we needed like a bow and arrow yeah. sound. Then we needed uh, a... Tracks, horse tracks, I think. Horse, yeah. Galloping and stuff. Um, yeah. Okay. Um, so let me try this again then. Welcome to Warhammer Wednesday. And it's actually Sunday. That's why me and Patrick are wearing our Cowboys yeah. gear. I'm sure we're in for a loss against the Browns. <laughs> uh, I predict we lose by 10. What do you but predict? Football's back, baby. Football's back. Um, I, a touchdown. You think we lose by a touchdown? A touchdown. Because their yeah. defense, the Browns defense. Browns are actually good this year. Yeah. And I do wish them luck because they've been bad for so for a long time. Yeah, they, and, they have uh, a really good D, though. Yeah. They say defense wants championships. not going to be a so. good Cowboys season for us today. Anyway, nope. number 21 but is facing off against number 22. 22 you know what we should do? We should do some Blood Bowl soon. Oh I think that would be really cool. Yes. Yeah, me and Patrick yes. love Blood Bowl. Yes. And I, even the boys next love week. Blood Bowl. So next we'll, week. We'll, we'll, we'll do some testing for it next week. Uh, but we're going to play our favorite tabletop game right now, which is Age of Sigmar, Sigmar. Spearhead. This is a 9 out of 10 set in stone for me it's everything i want it's small it's fast it's furious it's cheap it's cheaper fun. and it's fun as hell and there's tactical options and uh yeah so we have uh basically all the armies yeah. for this game yeah. minus two yeah which are are being painted I'm, and I'm, those are coming in i'm ready to see the blades of corn blades of corn are coming cool. lumineth realm lords yeah. are coming i know jay's gonna we'd like to one. do a tournament uh uh with once we get all the armies in then we're gonna do this tournament we're gonna see which one is the best yeah because we just love this game so much yeah. all right well but and in, in the meantime and sort of as a test stream we had patrick we just picked Two of the factions that haven't gotten much play. Um, and the Grave Lords are my main. You know, I want them to be one of my main armies. Yeah. When you when you have a bunch of armies, it's hard to pick have one. one yeah. But I wanna I, I wanna get good with these guys in Spearhead and yeah. do well in the tournament with them. Uh, Patrick is playing uh, the Cities of Sigmar, Sigmar, which are really cool, really creative, and in fact I'm starting to build up an army for them in the full game. Um, at, but they've only been played with once. Uh, so that's what's on the uh, docket today. Let's go ahead and take a look at the army lists for both factions in Spearhead. 
All right, well, we didn't chat. We didn't film the army lists. <laughs> we'll have to film those later and another time, maybe before the football game starts. Yeah. So just for, for editing's sake, boom, you take that first part. Then you obviously cut in the army lists. Right. And then I would like to do, you know, if we have We're a sponsor, we we'll do like a sponsor. Yeah. But for that? Spearhead, there is no roll because we rolled off camera so that we can already be set up, I think. Yeah. Um, sometimes we can do a sponsor. Other times we don't have to. Yeah. Let me see if I have a sponsor screen. Boobot's still doing Parabellum. Moobot is still doing Parabellum. Yeah, that needs to stop. But I don't think I have a mod with those powers. Okay, clean vlog. Here, here's sponsor video. What's this? Oh, okay. Just close. So <laughs> then I can add that. Um. I think I'm going to take that sound off the main 40K since it's more... Uh, you can hear it's more World War Two. Yeah, that's uh. And then I'm gonna put in the sponsor. That's bolt action. Bolt action, yeah. And eventually, I was gonna move all the sounds into that folder. folder. And in the future, we I might tell you how there's no good way to get everything into the folder at once. You know, you have to like. Yeah, do it one, one at a time. Demon Slayer, this is your time. Okay. Okay, so that's the sponsor. So we're sponsored by, oh, and then I'm all like, <laughs> I need to be short, shorter to get <laughs> you my, mean, uh, to get the camera right, yeah, for the sponsor. But I'm curious. Okay, whoa! Oh, too much, too much, too much. Yeah, I want like a, and then, We'll down. Go down. Yeah. Good. Perfect. Oh, it went back up. It went back up. Ah, that's good. That's good. All right. You like that? Yeah. Okay. But does it still look good over here? Yeah. Yeah. That's not bad. Okay. Hey! Hey! <laughs> like it again? Whoa. <laughs> is it good? Whoa. Yeah. <laughs> Give me a full breakdown. Hey, our <laughs> sponsor is Incubus. <laughs> Eight or 500 biddies. Thank you for the five hundred bitty donation, Incubus, and uh, first one down who nineteen <laughs> minutes ago subscribed. The Browns guys, good luck going to Bolts. Sir Frowski, uh, thank Browns. you so much for showing up for today and playing with us. Okay, I guess you're not playing with us, but you know, you know what I you're mean here when with I say us. that. You're here with us in spirit. Yes. All right. So then, you know. Um, I would I would press this for sponsor. Now I'm curious in post if I can replace what what is on here. This uh, change it with the sponsor or whatever. Yeah, and I I guess I can. At first I was thinking if you look at the little skulls with the wings, they are slightly. They cover the webcam slightly, so it would look bad if I were to stick a square there, you know, because It'd I would then need to cut out. out the edges. Yeah. I'd have to cut out these That's, edges. Yeah, corner. But maybe I'm overthinking it because honestly what I would do in post is I would just cover the entire, the whole the entire thing. thing with a new one. Yeah. And and it's just, just my talking. Yeah. It's just my talking that, that gets it. Yeah, and you just have the sponsor okay. superimposed on top. Right, yeah. Okay, so when we go from the army uh, screen... Then we would go to the sponsors. Hey, today's stream is sponsored by Frontline Gaming. These guys have the best gaming mats in the industry. Pretty much every um, battle report we do uses one of their mats. 
except for Spearhead. Spearhead has its own board, <laughs> but I would definitely buy a Spearhead map from them if they make one. In fact, I'm going to ask them to see if they, they make one. Uh, down below, we have 15% off in the description on any of our uh, videos on YouTube. You can find the description there and get yourself 15% off your order. They sell uh, all of the major tabletop games. And they run all of the major tournaments. They, they want to support the scene, and so we want to support them. So uh, thank you to Frontline Gaming for uh, sponsoring uh, our stream, or sponsoring our thing here. <laughs> <laughs> all right, and that's an example. And then I would put that over, and then that we would close the doors. Yeah. Okay, and then, so, so far, what's the order? The intro. So, sponsor. No, the intro, then Army, Army List, list then, then sponsor. sponsor. Then we're going to come to right from off. sponsors into deployment. Well, roll off and deployment will be the same. Yeah. So here is where I would do the deployment clean over. I'm going to change this button to deployment. Because it's a clean screen, it's easy for me to show off. So then we would go to this screen, and then uh, deployment begins in three, two, one. All right, so uh, we already rolled uh, previously. Actually, we, we, what we could do for Spearhead is we could leave our, our, our dice. Just remember what it was. Yours was a five, yeah. and mine was a four. And if you can move your dice to something. Yeah, there you go. Okay. Um, so then we would go deployment. So, all right, and here's what deployment looks like. Patrick one deployment five to four. Uh, so he declared himself the attacker. Yeah. He set up his cannon uh, right here. Uh, he's got his men at arms in the middle of the field, uh, followed by the marshal and uh, the unit of uh, cavaliers. The cavalry are on uh, this left flank right there. Uh, the Grave Lords have deployed, deployed like this. One unit of Death Rattle Skeletons way over on the left flank, and then the rest of the army on the right flank. A unit of 10 Death Rattle Skeletons. Uh, our best unit, the five uh, Blood Knights. Uh, Vampirella, is, the general, is right here. Yes. And as a army rule, the uh, Vargeists are not allowed on the board until turn three, which is really rough. But they can come in from yeah, anywhere. Those but, guys are scary. Yeah, and they have to stay, what is it, outside of six inches uh, when they come in. So that is the deployment. We are playing on the Akshi uh, board. And the twist is let the blood flow, which is one extra point for each unit destroyed during this turn. Okay, let's uh, get to the game. All right, clear the dice. And a unit is like the whole squad, right? Yeah, unit is the entire That's squad, right. yeah. Shuffle my cards. Okay, uh, play a zombie game? Oh, shit, you know what? <laughs> this faction, the death, uh, what is it? Oh, the Grave Lords. Grave um, Soul Blight Grave Lords do have zombies, and I did buy one unit of zombies. Hey. So technically, it is a zombie <laughs> game, but I don't have any zombies in my army. Got some scary little uh, Varguses, min or what I call them Varguses. Uh, yeah, var I want to call them <laughs> Varguses too. <laughs> I don't know if they're that scary. I wanted them to hit harder. I don't think they hit no. as hard as I wanted. They look there's scary. A, there's a taller one that's like a var. Uh, it's another var name. That yeah. one is scary. Yeah. Okay. Um, just ignore the Warhammer 40,000 label. In fact, just as an example, I want to see if uh, I can place something right there. Just over so it. what is it? Yeah, an image. Can you keep me updated on the time? What time is it? Uh, we're looking at uh, 12.36. Okay, so we got about three hours. Yeah. 
plenty of time. Uh, here's the Age of Sigmar logo. And here's what it would look like. Man, of course the guy, the running back that I bench is doing better than him. Oh shit, that works. It's a little blurry because I, I haven't is that is, is it blurry? It's a little blurry because it's a smaller version it's like of the a little image lower and, I, quality. and I blew it up, yeah. It's not too bad though. But uh, just to get an example of what it'll look like. Okay. So when we come to the board, um, so now I'm curious, like, do we, how do we film the rest of this? Um, so I am going to do turn summaries. Yeah. Um, and, and that might take care of everything. Especially if we were going to do a tournament and I have to, like, show multiple games in a single video, like, saying this round of the tournament, here's how this game went. Here's how this game Here's how this game went. But if we were to, you know, do a full battle report, you know, how, how would it look like? Because um, usually and, it's like turn also, summaries with highlights cut in. Yeah, that's how I would want to do it. That's our baseline. Yeah. That is going to be our battle report format one yeah <laughs> but i'm also kind of playing Trying with is there another battle report format that we can do um i think for for putting it on the angry joe show youtube channel people you know it it's a side thing it's a low views yeah, they're not going it's there for that not going there for that it's more just hey check out this quick little thing yeah, yeah, yeah. and so that's why we want to keep people it like short. curious like oh i've never seen 40k let me look at it yeah but I'm wondering if there's a way that we can do, uh, you know, uh, either a battle reports channel in the future or cut down little bits so that there's more in there for people that want more. But I think that would just be our live streams because we just yeah. don't want to make uh, any extra work. This is well, all yeah, done and in then our if they want to see, because usually the full ones go up on Angry Joe Show yeah. Live. Yeah, but I still want to just tr experiment. Yeah. So, so stick with me here. Um, I think what I'll do is let's say it's the movement phase. It's the movement phase. And uh, and I think we'll go into an overhead view for the movement phase. And then, you know, you state, state your intentions every time. It's annoying, but I want to state it every time on this thing. Oh, yeah. that, so I'll that, have to get used to that. Yeah. yeah. Because obviously we're bantering back and forth. We're learning our movements. But then you have to go... <gasps> For the edit. <laughs> yeah. I am going to move forward these death rattle skeletons here. Name, yeah. Okay. So, uh, first phase is the hero phase. Um, okay. I'm skipping the hero phase because I don't have any ones that can do anything. Uh, so, moving into the movement phase, I'm going to move these death rattle skeletons uh, four inches forward. Uh, which, ooh, it's gonna just barely be enough Get to you into touch the that point. for with pretty much just one, one guy, because uh, they move so slow. Now, in order uh, to charge, they would now need an eight. Um, but can that's they move? Move? No. 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 That's... Yes, so, Wonton Sushi. You do see. You see two Cowboys fans. His things got covered up by Mubai. But yeah, yeah, we represent Cowboys today, man. Okay, so to do that over again, where there's not, you know, any chances that, you know, it getting cut up. So uh, I'm moving this death rattle skeleton uh, unit four inches forward. 
I'm going to move this Death Rattle Skeleton unit four inches forward as well. Cool. But these are uh, previously uh, taken. Marked. Marked. And um, let's go. Let's go hard, right? So 10 inches. That'll get this guy here. So I'm gonna use, I'm gonna move the Blood Knights unit 10 inches this way. And I am moving the Vampire Lord uh, six inches up. Okay, movement completed. Um, shooting phase, none of my guys shoot. Uh, charge phase. Would need a 10. Maybe an 11. <laughs> uh, these are 8. This is 8. So the question is, do I want to? Um, let's see. Any combat phase. For each slain model, this unit make the legion roll return one slain model. Yeah, fuck it. Oh, we need to draw cards, too, don't we? Yeah, I forgot. You know, I would be honestly making it easier for you to get a point. Because the blood, remember, it is let the blood flow. Yeah. So let's say I charged you, impacted you. More than likely, I'm not going to wipe a unit, but I might bring it down quite a bit. Uh, but then you would follow up with your attack, and then that might actually kill it. You know what I mean? And then did we need to, like, uh, what am I trying to say? Do we need to tell each other our regiment abilities and enforcement enhancements uh, yeah. declare is what i'm trying to say yeah yeah that that would have been a good idea uh and i think we could do that in army lists okay so just to let you know mine is um so my enhancement for my general spirit gale or no i'm cloud of bats that lets her teleport all around the map okay. what is yours um my regiment ability is once per battle uh, enemy shooting phase, I can uh, use it as my shooting phase for the cannon. But only once per game. And mine is Endless Legions. Pick a friendly death rattle skeleton unit that has been destroyed. You can set up a replacement unit with D6 plus four models anywhere on the battlefield more than six inches away. Oh, wow. And then my uh, enhancement for this guy is he can return up to D3 slain models uh, if he's within my combat or within your general's combat range. Yeah. What does that mean? Combat range. Does that mean he has to be like right next to him? Yeah. Combat range is three inches. Three inches. Okay. Okay. So less powerful than I thought. I did not know the yeah. three inches thing. Mm hmm. Okay, so looking at this, and I, if I wanna if I wanna win, and you know I am practicing to win, I got I can't forget that this game's about points. Mm -hmm. um, if I moved off this unit of Death Rattle Skeletons, then they wouldn't be doing anything here. So I think what I wanted to do is I will run this unit of Death Rattle Skeletons four more inches. Dang. Well, that way, that we was, can pretty much just get them. That's there. the extra move is the run. Yeah, but now they're stuck there and they can't shoot no. and they can't charge. But they can score. But they can score. Uh, so now it is on to the charge phase, and I will try the extremely long charge. Uh, and because let the blood flow is in effect, I think it's easier to try to kill your general. So I'm going to charge your general. Um, I need a 10 or an 11. So the Blood Knights are charging. Uh, Patrick's general need a huge yeah. 10 or 11. Oh, no! Oh, no! 
nine. Nine is not going to do so it. Close. And so the Blood Knight stays put. put. And Thank I you, Patrick. Put, I like I that. Put, oh, <laughs> you put a card down? Yes. Yeah, okay. That's for the cutting. All right. Now the Death, ra uh, death Rattle Skeleton. Since these already scored this price one and they're not going to hold that down, let's give them a eight inch charge uh on the cavalry just to kind of turn off your cavalry you know prevent them from charging my cavalry yeah eight inches would be great to get uh, oh ooh. snake eyes, eyes. No a way. huge failure they stay put not good not good at all okay uh that was turn one for the uh death rattle or that was turn one for Okay, that was turn one for the Soul Blight Grave Lords. All right, going into my turn, I'm going to start with movement on my free guild Stillhelms here. They move at a five inch. And I'm going to get up as close as I can to you here. So Hold on, let's see. Do I. Should I do the individual? Oh, like yeah, after? Let me, let me do an okay. individual yeah. uh, at the end of the turn. So. Ooh. Camera with this. Army test. Okay, so that is the camera group. Sponsored tank explosion. I guess I don't need a tank explosion. So I could put this on the main. Recorded army list. Summary. Okay, this is the summary camera. And we are good. All right, here we go. Okay, at the end of turn one, this is what the Soul Blight Grave Lords did. Uh, Death Rattle Skeletons moved up there. Death Rattle Skeletons, uh, second regiment, ran to there, staying put. Uh, uh, Vampirella moves up. Blood Knights move up. Blood Knights failed their charge against the general as we wanted to go for blood and unfortunately failed. Uh, then the Death Rattle Skeletons took uh, a, a chance uh, to tie up the um, Cavaliers and also failed on a double one. So uh, the Death Rattle... So... So the Soul Blight Grave Lords, a little bit um, stunned. So the Soul Blight Grave Lords, a little bit stunned from their battle plans, uh, but we'll see. They will basically just uh, have to take a lot of uh, incoming uh, uh, human uh, fire. I don't know how to put any of this shit. It's, it's hard to come up with the it color on commentary the spot. is hard, right? Color yeah. commentary on the spot, so it's like, 
So the Soul Blight Grave Lords uh, battle plans, a uh, big old stick got in the middle of their battle plans, and now they're probably going to receive uh, some human payback. So let's check it out. Human turn one. Die? I think so. Hey. Yeah, I was that one. I got it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. So, if I use this card. I can still score it or no? What I forget. What yeah. Was it? yeah. When when you use that card, it'll pop back into your hand. When you use that card for the command, it'll yeah. pop back into your hand. And at the end of your turn, which is normally when scoring happens anyway. Yeah, you can still score it or save it to use it again. Or save it to use it again. Yeah. Uh, leather face. Okay. All right. Um, damn, I just, see, I just noticed. You see that blue alien? This guy? Yeah. Yeah. I think Tyranid? I, I think I just bought one, and I forgot I had one. <laughs> so, but it's lucky. Those are the underground motherfuckers that have been fighting in Space Marine, too, I right? I think that dig the underground. Ravengers, yeah. I think Ravengers look slightly different. This one's like a, a bigger version of the Ravenger. Oh, shit. Um, Those are and, son of a bitches, man. Yeah, and... Uh, can you bring him to me? Yeah. Fuck. I gotta break the seal anyway. Isn't it? Yeah. That's a cool model, though. Damn. It I is the same model. Yeah, I got two of them now. <laughs> and I don't think they're meta or they're very good. Uh, but he's already boxed it for me, so I can sell it on eBay. <laughs> This is what I'm talking about. I just bought another one of these guys, but apparently I already had them. So CA. Now we in business. You're in trouble now. <laughs> 40K and Age of Sigmar. Let's go. So that's two, four, six, eight. That's eight different summaries. Eight minute video if I'm not cutting in any highlights. The game is now fair. Wasn't fair before. Now it's fair. <laughs> so Patrick's going tinkle. We need to fix our PQ. PQ. CQ. Start moving, my guys. Okay. 
Uh, before you do, mm -hmm. um, we forgot that we got a score. Oh, yeah. So, uh, one, two, three, because uh, I control all these three points. That's good. And then I can score uh, hold ground, which is contest a large terrain, have more people than you. Oh, you got your captain back there? Yeah. Cool. So that's four points for uh, the Soulbite Grave Lords. The score is four to zero. That's a good start. Um, good start. Patrick, go ahead. All right. I am going to start by moving my Great Cannon here. Just scooting it up. It doesn't move far. Three inches. So I'm going to try to get in grape shot range of you. Okay. I'm going to grape you. You're gonna what me? I'm gonna <laughs> grape you. Yeah, I'm gonna grape you. That is that is allowed by tar TOS. Terms yes, of service. Yes, it is. You may grape someone. <laughs> grape graping. All right. Grape now, shot. Grape shot in range, baby. All right, and then we will move my steel helms, which move five inches. So we're gonna march up into your face here. Uh, I'd stay how many inches away? One inch. You have to stay three inches away. Oh, three inches. Okay. Yeah. So we're trying to make uh, the easiest charge possible. Yes. All right. So we're just going to scoot our steel helms up here. And then the real question is, who should I send my Cavaliers to here? I'm thinking I should send my Cavaliers to your cavalry. Well, it's kind of blocked over here. I can go up to 10, but I have to stay three stay inches. Stay outside of three inches three of inch everybody. Everybody, huh? Oh, wow, you have me in a little uh, mm -hmm. quinky dink here, huh? Yeah. So you, I basically you, can only go right here. Yeah, I'm screening. Oh, that's really nice. I didn't even intend to screen, <laughs> but this you is a higher, <laughs> higher level tactic. By closing this gap, there's really no room for him. So I'll go Stay right Stay outside here. of three, yep. Yeah, and it don't matter where they go. You can just you know, put them, and then when you charge. Yeah, stack them. Easy. Um, I'm just going to go right here with him. Staying out of three. All right, and that will conclude my movement. Yeah. Right there. Before your movement, there was your hero phase. Look at all your gold abilities. Oh, right. Um, oh, yeah, that's why I didn't use it, because it's, um, it's a declare. So pick a friendly steel guard unit within 12 inches. Okay, so there's two different effects. So I can roll, and on a 2+, plus, I pick one. On your feet. Uh, if a unit is in combat, uh, you can re if it's not in combat, you can return D3 slain models, which is not applicable right now. Um, or yield no quarter, which adds three to target's unit control. Oh, this might be helpful, actually. So uh, let me do that. So I am within 12 holy of mm -hmm. my um, steel helms right here. Yeah. And if I roll a, uh, I gotta roll a d6, and on a two up, I add three to the target's unit control. Control, okay. So here we go. Rolling, need two up for unit control. Hey, got it. barely, barely got, it. got it. So I add three to the target's unit control, which is these guys. Yeah. Uh, they go from. A one each. One each, yeah. To so now your unit of ten is like a unit of thirteen. Or does it add to twenty? I know three. Is it one to each model? No, it's one to. It's three to each unit, right? It adds three to the, to the unit. target's unit control score. Yeah. So it's thirteen. To the target unit. Yeah, it's either thirteen <laughs> or thirty. I think it's thirteen. Thirteen, because I think it just adds three to the, to the whole unit. thing. Yeah, so I think you're right. the whole unit is ten. Ten. Plus then three. Plus three. Thirteen. So that you win certain battles. Huh? Okay. All right, um, and that concludes my hero phase. And um, now we're on to shooting, I believe, because yeah. I already moved. Um, my only, I think my only shooties are this guy. It is, yeah. 
Oh my! Actually, this guy has a shooty yeah. too. Oh wow! Okay. He has a range. He has a dragoon pistol. But we'll start with uh, my grape shot. Grape shot. So that's gonna be twelve inches. Yes, so sir. Twelve inches. Twelve inches. It's five attack, hitting on three ups, wounding on three ups. So here we go. Five attacks. Roll, looking for threes both ways. Hey, got all of them. Nice. Um, Scary. Making sure I don't have any sort of ability. Well, for sixes, I do not. Boom, boom. So we're going to roll. I got another, let's get some more threes out of these boys. All right, not too right, shabby. Then. So that's four that went through. Um, it does have a rend of one and damage is two. Wow. <laughs> so four, rend one, mm -hmm. damage two. Uh, the Death Rattle Skeletons have a save of five. So their save goes up to six. Uh, and uh, yeah, so here's where uh, I need to do uh, a better job of like individualizing each uh, attack. Okay. So the cannon fired grape shot, got four wounds at rend one, damage two. Yep. I need sixes. <laughs> Rolling really low. Not a single one. So two, four, six, eight damage. So no you almost phones. wipe a complete squad. <laughs> that is massive, that cannon. It's fucking sweet. <laughs> Blown shit away. Blown to pieces. Blah, blam. Okay. Right. So, oh, and then I'll do my uh, dragoon. Well, I'm going to make sure. Yeah, that's within 10 inches. So I'll do my dragoon. Well, hmm. Oh, it's only two attacks. So I might as well try to. Uh, the human score a Huge victory with that cannon blast. I'm going to try to finish it off with the Dragoon Pencils with, from my uh, Cavalier Marshal into the rest of your little unit right here. Okay. Um, it is ten, two attacks on three ups. Hey, both. Okay. And then I'm wounding on a four up here. Okay. Um, see how that goes. Oh, just barely. Mm -hmm. So both of them go through, and that's a uh, rend one, damage one. Okay. Uh, the hey, look at this guy. Uh, this. Hey, <laughs> what's up, Devin? What's up, the uh, How you doing, man? <laughs> Cowboys. He got he has cowboy yeah, hat on. Cowboy, you can't see him. He's off screen, right there. But Devin, come over here. <laughs> yeah, sit by Joe. Pull up that chair. Angry Mexican. Watch this camera. Don't don't hit it. <laughs> Devin's in the house, hey, everybody. Devin right there. <laughs> Let me go to my camera. Hey. Look at that cowboy hat. I like <laughs> I like bearded Devin. Looking man. good, Devin. I like bearded Devin. <laughs> I do like bearded Devin. <laughs> hey, look at some Special of guest Devin. mobsters. <laughs> Let him cook. <laughs> Where's the uh, headset? Put that on. Oh, ja, you can't put it on with your hat on. Josh ja said that's a every every Texan gets a complimentary cowboy hat upon birth. I wish. This is our new favorite tabletop game, Devin. It's uh it's called Age of Sigmar. It's Warhammer Age of Sigmar, and it's fantasy. And as you can see, it's played on a very small board, so games are like an hour, and yeah, they're really they're really quick, really fun. Uh, he just blew. I had a unit of ten skeletons. Yeah, you missed me. And he Blast just him. blasted Grape them with a cannon. Grape killed him. eight of them right there, and then he just pistol pistoled uh, these two more. So I need <laughs> sixes to save because his pistol's so powerful. Oh. That's terrible. So the unit is completely yeah. wiped. So that gives you one extra victory point. So the score is now four to one. All right. All right. What else? Um, so that's the end of my shooting phase right Correct. there. Yeah. Um, and now we're going to go on. Flippy, thank you for raiding with a party of 15. Flippy. This piece of shit. What the this fuck <laughs> is this piece of shit? <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God, I love that one. The only one I love more is I ain't, 
I didn't do shit. I didn't do that. fucking shit. Yeah, that one. All right, I might have screwed myself by taking out that army because now I took away my short charge. Yeah. Because now, you know, for that, what the fuck is this piece of shit? I like, you know, it's uh, what's that guy's name? Danny. Uh, uh, no, uh, not Danny. Uh, DeVito. I know, not it's, it's something. Joe Pesci. Joe, Joe Pesci. Yeah. Yeah. So <laughs> you notice how Joe Pesci was big and then he got small. Yeah. I need to just take that small Joe Pesci so and little? make him big so oh. he's the same size when he looks. At, <laughs> you know, you see the back of him yeah. and the front of him. He needs to be the same size. Uh, mini mini version. Yeah. Um, yeah, I made these charges a lot harder because I've already moved. So now, because I did my... I. Yeah, so, it, it, I mean, you don't have to charge, but if you do want to charge, it's going to be an 8 right there. This is like an 8. This is a 3. Uh, you did kill one of the skeletons, which opens up the... Uh, uh, what do you call it? Uh... I was screening with both of the skeletons, yeah. and that's like a seven. So uh, here's my question to you. Can I just advance with these guys? No, because they've already moved. Moved, okay. Yeah. So So now this is the charge phase. Right. So it's like this whole unit is stuck together? No. I just, it, it makes it easier to yeah. move them. Well, let me, let me start he's with he's got, he doesn't, he has 10 and he hasn't. So you're going to start with that one? Yeah. All right. Let me see an eight. Eight. Oh. Seven. You All missed right. by one. So I'm going to burn this card. What is a card All do? right. That was my upside down card. Yeah. That I had hidden. Yeah. And it's forward to victory. Uh, use this during a charge ability. You can reroll the charge. Okay, hold on, hold on. That, that that's upside down. Oh, I yeah. And is that facing you? That is facing. It's yeah. It's facing All right, me. then I will flip it. Vertical, horizontal, and then flip. Vertical. Samurai Queen, <laughs> what's up? Okay, All so right. it allows you to do what? It allows me reroll. Yeah, re-roll. All right, go ahead and re-roll it. And I get to keep it since that's my whatever Correct. ability. Nice. Yeah, you that's actually, actually used it. <laughs> you actually used a good one. <laughs> oh, we're off to a good Six. Start. You know, a one will fail. No! No! <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for <laughs> making these epic <laughs> moments, Patrick. Now, why Joey do power. I roll one so much? Mm. It was... Uh, you had one job. Yeah, one job. <laughs> God damn it, Joey dude. used his own power <laughs> yeah. to get that one. Um, fuck, dude. Let me... Who's that over there? Is that Wonder Woman? <laughs> this is Vampirella. Vampirella. It's a custom miniature. She's a vampire? She's a vampire, yeah. And they're normally led by vampires that look like this. But, you know, I like my vampire better than that one. Oh, okay. I want to charge here to here. Well, yeah, that's a three inch charge. Because <laughs> this would be. That would be a seven, seven or a six. Seven or. Uh, probably a six. <sighs> I would really like to tie them up. But I also would like to fight, too. I'll be back and forth. Yeah. All right. Well, I'm probably going to regret this, but I'm going to go for the easiest choice. Okay. Let's see if I actually roll a six. A three. <laughs> Hopefully. Oh, my God. I would have rolled yeah, a six. You're in. Yeah. If I would have gone the other one, though, I would have made it, too. But I didn't want to. After that <laughs> epic fail, man. Yeah. I didn't want to risk it. Um. And with this guy, I'm not going to do... I think I'm just not going to charge at all because I don't want him going against okay. a whole a whole group of good dudes. Um, yeah, so did I, I mark that one? Yeah, did you start on top of it? Yeah. Yeah, and then mark the other one. Yeah. yeah. Dang it. So I didn't get to the middle. I was really trying to get to the middle there. Yeah. Um, cause that concludes my, uh, charging, charging. Yeah. Now fight. And I do get to fight. That's right. With this one guys. So we'll see the Cavaliers go at it here. Um, and so I actually did miss one thing at the end of the charging phase here. Uh, it's ability called, 
uh, devastating charge oh, wow. that they have. And uh, so during this unit's charge phase, pick an unit, enemy unit combat. Wait, pick an enemy unit in combat with it to be targeted and roll the dice. So that one right there. Uh, roll a dice on D2, afflict, inflict D3 mortal wounds on the target. So you got a two, barely. just barely. <laughs> now you get to roll the black die. <laughs> yeah, oh, here we go. There we go. Oh. Yeah! God three. damn it. Did you get a three? <laughs> you yeah. son of a bitch. Uh, three go down immediately because they don't have a... Oh, they do have a ward save of oh. six up. Right. Which actually, then you I should have rolled... wards? Yeah. yeah so, so, so let me roll six... For your whole army. Yeah. Six up on... No, I think it's just the death rat. Oh, it might be. Yeah, it is the whole army. All right. So for these death rattle skeletons, uh, sixes will res one. one. and But then you shot them with a two-shot? Uh, it was a two-shot pistol? Yes. Nothing there. So a single guy Come is back. left. Oh, right here, yeah. man. Look at that. I don't, I don't really want him left because I want, uh, you know. Oh, to man, die. but that means I could have charged him into that guy. Yeah, that's true. Um, eh, whatever. I'm no, let's do it. Are you sure? Yeah, because if we were playing right, yeah, then I, I would have rolled my wards, and I'm sure I would have saved one or two. So push those guys into combat as well. Okay. Just, just for the sake of... Yeah. And that'll get you one extra point. Potentially, you're going to get a ton of points, especially if these if you could wipe this unit with that these cavalry. No. So you did good uh, initially by killing three just from the impact of the charge. Now we're going on to the number of attacks. Yes. So the melee weapons... Uh, I have two, I guess, because I have the horses. Uh, yeah, so you start with, let's do the hooves last yeah, okay. and separate. So uh, let's cavalier start with all weapons. The yeah. There are three attacks, uh, four ups, and there's five of them. So that's 15 attacks. And this does have a ability of charge plus one damage. So I believe this one time since I charged in, I get... Plus one on plus damage? One, yeah, wow. plus one on damage. So... Powerful as hell. Six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, fifteen. All right, so we're looking fifteen four ups is what we're looking for here. Okay. Not four great. ups is the hard part. Oh my yeah. god, bro! You'll see how tough. Look how many is. ones and twos this. Yeah. Is. <laughs> Fours is hard to get. Uh. All right, so we ended up with less than a quarter of them. Fives are impossible. Yeah, so we're going for four ups again. Hey, oh, that you was got actually, super that lucky, was you son of a bitch. Let's go. Okay. That, fir that first one sucked. Yeah. Um, yeah, so that's going to be six on Rend one. Rend one. And two damage. It's usually one damage, but oh, now. It's two two damage. damage. You might wipe them here. Uh, this five save goes up to a sa six save. So one. one save, five go through, but guess what? Two, four, six, eight, ten damage. Is but that? doing the ward, oh, yeah. I ward. need sixes, but I don't think I can get enough sixes. Oh, it's three. I got three sixes, but this is uh, six, seven skeletons are killed. And that's the exact number of skeletons oh. that were left. So you didn't even get to the hooves. That, yeah, that was... That was great. That charge. That was, second roll, yeah. all hit, all was, wounds, yeah. that's, that's what did Well, because that first roll was dog shit. So then there's another extra point for let the blood flow. Yeah, because that was the So you wiped roll. that unit. Oh, you haven't wiped this unit yet, but it's my turn to attack. Don't worry, it's only <laughs> uh, two attacks. Fours and fours. And a four. Got one hit at no rend. All right. That's all these guys. The Steel Hounds. Wait, wait, four. wait, wait. Oh. Stopping everything. Mm -hmm. uh -oh. <laughs> I need to read my abilities better. Uh, Skeleton Legion. For each slain model from this unit, make a Legion roll of a D6. Oh. On a five plus, return one slain model. They get like a re construction like 
Yeah, so we'll see how many actually get retained. So all 10 of them died. Mm -hmm. uh, so let me roll 10 dice, and we'll see. Uh, on fives. Re resurrect them. I got one. three, a paltry three left. And this ability alone is going to prevent you from getting that that blood, that point. Yeah. Uh, and then something that I failed to do last time, I'm going to roll nine dice here. You might for have to be fighting more skeletons for than the you cannon. thought. Yeah. Fives. Uh, three skellies three come again, back. Yeah. I like that ability. Yeah, it's it's uh you know yeah. reconstituting. They're yeah. still gonna die, but what it does allow me to do is it allows me to uh, fight you a little harder. So disregard yeah. my fight, and it's two, four, six, eight dice. Yeah, now you're hitting back. Two attacks, <laughs> fours and fours. Okay. That's not too bad. Not too Damn. bad. And fours, not too bad. Four yeah. hits, no rend. So four hits, no rend. Four uh, wounds, no rend. Four wounds, no rend, and I have a four-up save. Yep. All right. Let's see some fours. Uh, Only one block, so three men are dead. Wrong, wrong one. <laughs> wrong universe. <laughs> All right. Um, I'm going to go ahead and fight back. Mm -hmm. So now I only have seven. Because three got taken out. Um, these guys, the Steel Helms, are doing two attacks each. So... That is 14 For dice. For the Skell Emperor. Skell Emperor. <laughs> <laughs> Six, eight, Do you ten, say 12, 14. I want to learn how to play this so bad. How was Warhammer this year turned out to be? It is so easy, Dwarp Terp. Just go to your local gaming store if you have one and buy a spearhead box of your favorite army. There's going to be tons of people that want to play with you because they want to play their armies. You make new friends fast. And Spearhead, what we're playing, is the best tabletop game I've played in so long. It's like a 9 out of 10. Very good. When you're getting into the game, it's easy. Look, my girlfriend hates tabletop <laughs> games, <laughs> and even she likes it. All right, so, so that's like the biggest endorsement that there ever was. <laughs> All right. So I got uh, half of the those. The hobby is expensive, though. You're looking to probably spend $140, though. So we're looking at four ups again. I've rolled 14 four ups and only got seven. Yeah. And now we're looking to wound at four up. But these models <sighs> last you for the rest of your life. So, so that's only going to be four, four wounds at one damage. And no rend. No rend. Okay. I've got five up armor save. Okay. Mm. Two blocks. And two skellies are dead. But remember, they resurrect on a five. For each slain model in this unit, make a legion roll of d6. For each 5+, plus, return a slain model. So one <laughs> more comes up. So only one dies. Hard to kill, wow, man. Hard, to, hard take to take kill. out. But I, for, wait, I like this much better, though, because yeah. when you were doing it before, I was like, this is a little too easy. Yeah, yeah, you're crushing it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Which, actually, if you're playing any other faction, you would have crushed it. <laughs> right? But... Yeah. But these are the Skelly Boys. These are the Skelly They're Boys. They're just yeah. being reanimated. Okay. So, I think that is the end of your turn. Yeah, did you fight back there? Mm-hmm. No, I didn't fight back there because those are the guys that came back. So, right. two, four, six are going to fight you. These Skellies are hitting you on fours and fours. There's fours. That's pretty good and roll. Yeah, that's a good roll. And two, two. wounds at no rent. Two wounds, someone's free. Oh, these are the Cavaliers. They have a three up save. Ah, one went through. One, one, one damage on one of the cavalry. I put, I put Got it. Got a marker? Got a marker. Okay, nice and clean, effective. I love it. Yes. Um, let's go ahead and get the uh, summary camera in here and do a summary for your turn. 
Um, do I need to? I'm sorry. I'm looking at scoring. Real quick. Uh, yeah. So I think we should do scoring in in this before, right? So go ahead and score. So you have two points. Let's go to the overhead cam. You've got two points, that and that. So that's going to get you one, two. And then do you have any cards? Um, so I do have this one card, mm -hmm. which is the Phoenix or whatever. Okay, so you got the Phoenix. So and these other that'll two get you I four. Don't. You tied it up. Um, oh, yeah, because I didn't you get didn't that one kill, for... Yeah, yeah. For yep, yep, yep. All right, ready? Yes, sir. All right, Cities of Sigmar, turn summary. The cavalry decided to charge. The uh, skeletons made a nice little uh, screen so that the uh, cavalry couldn't charge my blood knights. Exactly what I wanted. He charged into the skellies, did a ton of damage, but the resurrection prevented them uh, from scoring the let the blood flow extra points really really helpful the resurrection on the skeletons here They took uh, a bunch of grape shot and then uh, these guys came in and charged and did a bunch of damage wait I don't think Have, have those guys gone yet? Oh, yeah, they did go. Yeah, yeah. yeah they just didn't kill a lot they of my did, guys. Yeah, they didn't finish uh, They didn't off. hit hard enough. Yeah. So uh, three skellies are left there. Uh, however, I just realized that the point actually flipped over to you. Go ahead and put huh. yours because you have more units there than oh, I do. Right. And so then, you actually now officially take the lead. Uh, Patrick, five. Angry Joe, uh, four. But this is exactly what I wanted to happen and exactly effective use of a skeleton uh, chaff and uh, screening. Now I've got them where I want them and I can charge where I want and hopefully I hit hard enough and we'll see what my uh, Vampirella can do as well. It's still uh, going into turn two. The Vargas, the Varguses are not showing up. <laughs> they are not here until turn three. So we just got to hold the line. All right, let's get the vampire counterattack. Yeah, I feel like your caval cavalry is about to come in and do fucking work, boy. <laughs> I'm hoping. Sometimes you can get, have a really, really bad roll. Yeah. All right, so let's start this thing off uh, into the... Uh, oh, we're going to turn two. Do we have to roll to... Yeah. Oh, that's right. Because in this game, we have no idea who gets yeah. it. Oh, yeah. fuck, Patrick <laughs> could get it. But then I couldn't score any cards because that would be a double turn. Yeah. But... I could fucking lock up your cavalry, which would be nice. Well, I don't think. I just oh, no, I can't because no, I'm locked you're, up. No, because you're locked yeah. up in combat. Oh. I need to win this yeah. desperately. Yeah, okay, shit. Fuck. Wait, wait. Uh, yeah, yeah. All right, here All we right, go. Here we go. Fuck. Fuck. Three. <laughs> One. Oh, thank God. Why do I roll so thank bad? Thank God. <laughs> oh, I love it. I love that the rolls <laughs> matter in the game, but, you know, who... <sighs> yeah. Damn it. That would have been nice for me. Yeah. All right. So, uh, but now we uh, do the new twist. Oh, I at the end of my turn, I had a thing. Okay. It's, uh, it's the enhancement I chose. Uh, so I have to pick a friendly uh, steel helm unit within the general's combat range, mm -hmm. which should be... This right here. Yeah. These guys. Um, and I can uh, return up to D3 slain models to that unit. So hopefully three. Okay. So you have a resurrection yeah. as well. Nice. So that will bring them back here into the battle. Yeah, I actually have two, two, and these guys are reinforced as well. Wow. Okay. That's pretty cool. All right. Uh, here is the new twist. Blood marked. The underdog picks a unit in each player's army that is on the battlefield to be blood marked. Uh, basically, one extra victory point if that unit is destroyed. So basically, the same one as last time, only a specific, specific one unit. Is, is blood marked. Oh, and so. you're the underdog, so do you choose or? Yeah, I choose one in each. 
so you still have a chance to, to kill mine. I'm going to say my cavalry are the one that you're blood marking. And then <laughs> I get to choose what to blood mark on you. Who can I destroy for one extra victory point? I don't think that the cavalry are, are powerful enough to wipe your cavalry in one go. Uh, I would like them to be. But I'm just not sure. Uh, so how many wounds does your cannon have? Uh, my cannon has eight health. Eight? Yeah. And does any of its abilities on its ranged combat say shoot in combat? Grape shot? Of the abilities, no. I do have uh, my martial. None of them. Sh yeah, your martial shoots in combat, but not your cannon. No, I do have melee weapons, the crew's tools and sidearms, but it's not very right. good. <laughs> okay. Um, let's do this. Um, so it's my hero phase. Pick up visible within six inches. All right, I'm going to use my once per game ability for my vampire. Uh oh. <laughs> she turns into she bats. Turns into bats. Beep, 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 beep. And then she's going to show up <laughs> over here and be six inches from your cannon, and she's going to charge him in the future. However, pick a visible enemy within six inches of this unit to be the target. So that was the move. Hold on, I need to finish my movement. <laughs> um. How much health for each uh, cavalry? Uh, three. Each cavalry has three, so I would need to do 15 wounds. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure about 15 wounds. I am sure about wiping your... I'm sure about wiping your soldiers. But you know what might be even more clever is to come over here and charge at three inches and, <laughs> and wipe that fucking cannon. How many? And just it? let let you be tied up by chaff. I think that. That might actually be the move. Huh. I'm gonna try to use my big brain and do that <laughs> three inches away. And then I gotta be three inches away from these guys. Right there. And then... Does that officially move you onto your shooting? Because I will use my once per battle. I'm still in the movement for right now. Um, yes, it act, now I'm done moving. So we go into the... Oh, wait. Before we do that... Um, Okay, uh, before we did that, we're going to do vile transference uh -oh. uh, with the hero uh, unit. So Vampirella is going to use a spell here and suck your blood. Is that like a hero thing? It's a spell. Yeah, hero thing. But is it hero phase? It's hero phase. So I didn't move these guys yet. So she it, wouldn't been moved? She's moved. Her, her, so it goes... Oh, you're right. Thank you. So the hero phase comes before the or movement move, phase. Yeah. So, yeah, that wouldn't have gone off. Um, okay, so movement phase is over. What did you want to do? Uh, so we're, we're into officially in the shooting. We are in the shooting phase, yes. So I can declare my iron will. When you're in your shooting phase, once per battle, I can uh, pick my great cannon and use shoot ability as if it was my own shooting phase. Oh my god, are you serious? Yes. So I'm going to grape shot it into <laughs> your cab here. Well, I don't know. I well, don't know if I want to go against your... How, what's the inches on the gra uh, grape shot? Grape shot is 12 inches. But 
also going to go into your hero, too. Ten inches? Twelve. Twelve inches. So you were outside of range before. Um, yeah, I wouldn't have charged you if you had no told me that there was going to be a grape shot coming in. Because that's, what, threes and threes? But you're not charging yet. You're, you're yeah, but moved. I'm not going to go that way if the immediate reaction is you grape shotting me. That's a feel bad. That's like a, I didn't even know. But that's why I have the once per battle turn after the movement into the shooting phase. It's like the yeah, whole, but the whole I'm not going to go it. over there. The point, the whole point of it is not a gotcha, Patrick. <laughs> it's just your idea. It's not a gotcha. It, uh, in, in Warhammer, uh, the right way to play. Now, you can play that way if you want. No. But the right way to play is, hey, I'm just letting you know that if you do that, I have an ability that's going to grape shot your face uh, on your turn. So because I didn't know that your cannon does that, and if I did know, see, basically. Well, I told you in the beginning I, of the battle. So, but in all future battles, I wouldn't do this, and I probably wouldn't do this here. But if you want to grape shot me anyway, I mean, you can you fine. can choose to back them up, and then I'll just grape shot the other lady. Yeah, yeah, I mean, because I'm not moving her. I, that was my intent, is to definitely go in on them. So, but maybe maybe I got to leave them there. If you, since, yeah, you can since, move. I'm not trying to, I'm not trying to uh, be, def like, you know, we're casually playing. So if you want to yeah, move them back. If I want to move them back, I can't. Can. Thank yeah. you, thank you, thank you. Um, I'm considering it, but I don't know if I can. I'm trying to find some way where I can get. A kill. <laughs> and I think I think we got to do it. Grape shot me, Patrick. <laughs> yeah. Where do you want me to grape you? I don't know. Where do you want to <laughs> grape me? <laughs> do you want to uh, grape Vampirella or do you want to grape the Blood Knights? Oh, man. Maybe. Vampirella has um, a three up save, five health. The Blood Knights have a three up save, three health. Okay, let me do the the knights then. The knights? Yeah, okay. I guess there are more of them. There's more knights. But, um, I mean, this is pretty much the last action of my cannon, I feel yeah, like. Yeah, your cannon is going to die. <laughs> so let me go ahead and go for the cav, I guess. Okay. Um, so that's the grape shot. That's five shots, three up. Yeah, and that's why we play like this, uh, Surf Roski, is <laughs> is we let people know about the gotchas. Three, four, five. Okay, five up. I three. think it's fair to tell people something once, and then in that same game, if they make the same mistake, oh, then you look oh, how bad that roll was, dude. That was a bad roll. Fuck. Uh, I got lucky. Yeah, that's not great. Um, so I need three ups on this one. Three up. Okay, Got I it. got both of those. Rend uh, what? Rend one, damage two. So okay. the most Ooh, I can do is, is, four is kill one yeah. and hurt one other. Yeah, it's not All great. right, so uh, the cannon has uh, reacted to my movement and is doing a free ability, uh, a once, once per battle, battle ability yeah. of grape shotting my face. <laughs> I need uh, fours to save. Spinner. Oh. Spinner, oh, one goes six. through. I saw six. six. Ah! <laughs> Only all that for nothing, yeah. man. Fuck. Well, one went through. So that's two damage. It's two damage, and these guys have a six-up ward save, so if I grab more sixes, no. Uh, that means two damage on one of my knights. So n a single knight did not die. Thank God. And maybe I should have done the just the regular cannonball, which is a range of 24, but it has... I do have to hit on fours, but mm -hmm. I wound on twos. The rend is two. Ooh. The damage is D3 plus two. Let's pretend that you did that So and see what would have happened. But it's only two attacks. Okay. So I'd have to hit so on fours. So those fours up. are hard to hit. Ooh, I, I would hit it. Both. Oh, my now God. Now twos. I would hit them both. And both shots. Oh, my God. And now, it was rend two, right? Yeah. Rend. So that would mean I would save on fives. Yeah. I still saved. This is the exact same roll. Uh, and then I uh, rolled D3. Now you D3 plus. So I did four. Five. D3 plus what? Two? Two, yeah. So four, four. instead of. Was that two? Two, yeah. So it would have been a little eh, bit better. Not much. Though. Yeah. All right. Well, that was a whole Probably lot. Probably would have been enough to kill <laughs> one, though. 
I, I, I'll, I had to have him go out swinging, though, because that's going to be the – once you charge, it's going to be over for yeah. for that guy, those it guys. Is. And we are now officially in the charging phase. Yes. So we'll go Vampirella's charge of six up. She's in. Now we go the Knight's charge of three up. Oh, Ooh. four, yeah, five. <laughs> okay. Oh, These man. Are, Locked in. That's These guys it. are toast. Yeah, they're done. Fuck. They have eight health, but all they have is a bunch of sticks and barrels and balls. Iron balls. All right, so let's go with the a Blood Knight charge. Let's see what happens. Uh, three attacks each, so that's 15. And plus one damage on a charge. They hit on threes, wound on threes. So many dice still, doesn't it? <laughs> if you rolled a bunch of ones and twos, still. See, so five. There's still five. Fuck it. Five at rend one. Yeah, see, now that turns it into I have to roll five. Five ups. Five two. five ups. Here we go. Yeah, two damage each because of the oh, charge. Oh, man. That's what's going to hurt. That sucks. Hey. That's, I mean, I saved two. Two. <laughs> so you receive six damage. Hey, you survived two, four, six, yeah. for right now. We have two more, yeah. Two uh, more and then, oh, my God. Well, you survived. But well, now you still we got the a, hooves. Yeah. So now the hooves, hooves and teeth from the nightmares. So fives and threes. Ooh. This is hard. Fives. But the threes are gonna not going to be And then two. threes. Ugh, bad roll. Only two. Ooh. Two at no rend. So four ups. I need two fours here badly. Uh, uh, only one. Was that two damage or one, one damage? One damage. So you're telling me I'm down it to received one. a full Blood Knight <laughs> charge and survived. Down to seven damage or seven health? Or down to one health, I guess. You're down to one health, yeah. How much health did you have total? Eight. Yeah, so you were at six. There goes plus one for seven. So you got one health left. I can't believe I didn't kill you. <laughs> you still you have got the enough. freaking, you still have Babe Varela. I do have Babe She will Barbarella. definitely kill you. However, it is now your turn. Yeah. So um, where are you fighting back? Are you going to fight back? I feel back? like I have to fight back there because this is my, my, last, my last swing on you here. Yeah. Um, they only do two attacks and hit on four ups, wound on fours. And it's only one damage. So I am kind of inclined just to let them die. The skeletons, you don't really care about, but uh, it's up to you. Let me at least go out swinging with them. Yeah, go out swinging? Yeah. Okay. All right. Two, uh, well, I guess I need to declare on who I'm fighting. Well, I, I guess my better chances is on the, the Cav. Uh, Cav have saved three. She has saved three. So yeah. it really doesn't matter. But one's hurt. One of the calves is One hurt. of the calves is hurt. Yeah. yeah. So One of the calves has one wound left. Let me try to go for the kill shot. Okay. On that. Two attacks, four up. See if you get lucky. Yeah, lucky. All right. One still. Got to hit a, another four up. All right. Here we go. Hey. Okay. <laughs> but no red, no right? Red. Three up save. <laughs> Blocked. <laughs> Damn it! <laughs> so you pull out a pistol, but before you could shoot, <laughs> I pike you. All right, well. You going to go um, hit back, or I guess, no, you can go. Well, so I guess this. the smart thing is, yeah, you're, since those guys are done, I might need to do one of these before yeah. they die. Definitely. Um, and it's like, what? Uh, do, do your men at arms have reinforcement? The Steel Helms do have reinforcements, yes. If they die? Okay, shit. Um, but your horsies do not have reinforcement. Correct. Uh, I guess... Let's fight your horsies. Okay. All right. Uh, fours and, and fours. Wow, good roll. Oh, yeah. But can I maintain that? 
No, I can't maintain Ooh. it. One one wound at no rent. No rent, three up. Ha! Ah, it went through. All right, he's still not dead. He only <laughs> has one, one wound left. All right, your turn. All right, uh, I guess the sensible choice is right here. In the middle with my steel helms. Yep. Um, they're back to full strength, so that's uh, two attacks each, so that's 20 attacks. Did you ever play the RTS game Alien vs. Predator that's on the Xbox? Yes. I enjoyed it. It's difficult to control, but it's worth playing if you... Uh, I mean, that shit was happened a long time ago, bro. I <laughs> rented that at Blockbuster. That's Damn, how long ago that that's was. Yeah. The RTS. I forgot what it was called, too. Yeah. There was Marines, Predators, and Aliens. And it was RTS. Yeah. I'm, I'm, that the boy Burt. All right. I'm, how many turns in, in Ace Hatch? In Spearhead, Scooby Druid, there's only four turns. 20 on four ups. Look at how difficult four ups are. So I think you're starting to understand, like yeah. I am, that four ups are not great. Is is not good. Not great. Five ups impossible. Six. There's no. I don't even think there's a unit that hits on <laughs> sixes. Oh uh, yeah, that's not great. <clears throat> All right. So how much you get? Uh, seven. Two four. Six. Yeah, seven. So seven, and then I need four ups again. Yep. Seven four ups. Let's see it. No, not good. So that was only three. Three total. Any rend? No rend. All right, I'm going to block all of these. Here I need go. fives. Only one. <laughs> but those two skellies that die can Number resurrect five on up. fives. And Woo! one resurrect. Man, you're you're getting at least one. It's only one, one dead. Res Is that not wild that only one dies after a full a full round of attacks? <sighs> It feels kind of cinematic if, because it's like, yeah, or thematic because you know you're like chopping down skeletons and they just like they get just back pop up. Right yeah. up. So here's the skellies attacking you back fours and fours, and I'm rolling these well. Yeah, you damn two wounds. Two wounds. I'm gonna laugh if two of you guys <laughs> die. <laughs> uh, no rins, four up save. No! Hey! <laughs> <laughs> two of your assholes. <laughs> <laughs> So I won on that. Yeah, <laughs> goddamn. I got two, you got one. You bet this is not uh, Old World, which would break their morale and they just, like, Jeez. have a chance to run away. All right. Uh, um, or no, you still have uh, Homegirl. Yeah, fit me. Homegirl. Uh, well, no, I chose them instead of Homegirl. It's your turn now to finish me off with the Knights. Oh, yeah. So yeah, but those that. Knights... Let's just say you, you do three points of damage. There's no, there's no point. Yeah, because I'll hit with hooves yeah. and weapons. But what you want to know is whether they'll respawn. Yeah, that's the thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, all right. So let's uh, see. five ups. If I get a single five up, I still tie you up. No! Oh, thank God. Oh, Whew. finally got rid of yeah. the skellies. Oh my God! They're yeah, they just kept popping back up. Stay down, motherfucker. Damn. Stay dead. Nice. All right. Left flank is looking good for you. Uh, I was hoping they'd hold there. And okay, yeah, Vampirella now to finish off yeah, your cannon. She has uh, five attacks, threes and threes. Ooh, all, all hit. And wounding on threes. Three wounds at rend one, damage two. So three run. Yeah. Five ups. So I need three fives and I'm dead. Nope. Yeah, dead. you're dead. Blah! Yeah. That's an explosion right there. Yeah, I gotta get one extra <laughs> victory point for that killing. Go ahead and remove that. Oh, unit was this my mark? That was your mark. Yeah, Shit. my blood knights were the mark. Good, good stuff. And we'll check the board. I get one. Two, and now I got that one. So there's three. So I go to eight. And can I score any of these cards? Oh, um, 
What I needed to do was draw one card. Did you have... Or no, you used your card. No, I used my card, so I don't get to draw a card yet. Let me see if I do any of these. Uh, you complete this battle tactic at the end of your turn if you use fight and no friendly units were destroyed. Unfortunately, you did destroy one of my units. Attack on two fronts. I uh, couldn't complete that either. I don't get any points from cards. Damn, my point generation is not very good. Uh, all right. Well, let's do turn summary here. Okay, at the end of turn two, that is, this is what it looks like. The Blood Knights decided to charge the cannon, and surprisingly, the cannon actually survived a Blood Knight charge. It had like one health left, so Vampirella had to uh, finish off the cannons. Over here, this was hilarious. I only had three skellies, and the humans could not get it done. Uh, the skellies resurrected, and he killed one skelly, and I killed two humans. And then over here, uh, the skellies uh, all died, obviously, to five cavalry. I was just hoping that I would roll all fives and all three would still survive. But unfortunately, I rolled nothing and the skellies were officially wiped, freeing up the human cav. So that really uh, makes uh, Patrick's left flank a lot stronger. And uh, yeah, and I managed to score uh, three points. So the score is eight to five right now. Okay, going into turn three. All right. Oh wait. Well, uh, no, this is no, my this side is, of turn two. Yeah, your your side of turn two. Um, which I can't really do much because everybody's tied up besides those guys, I guess. Yeah, those so guys are free. Well, let me do my hero phase first. Um, so pick a friendly unit within twelve inches not in combat those guys are in combat those are the only ones i can heal so i'll do yield no quarter again if i roll two up i get uh the 13 commands or whatever all right so i got it so they have the extra command points three extra command points um, oh before that i need to get cards We get cards, yeah. Really so I'm going to trash these two cards. No, it's not Are a new turn yet. Oh, so do I need to get... When do I get new cards, though? Yeah, then I needed new cards. I, I, uh -oh. fu I fucked up. Uh -oh. Okay, so um, let me see if I could score that. You needed cards. Yeah. So grab one, right? You need one? Well, I want to get rid of all of them. Okay, well, then go ahead and, and get rid of all of them. Well, but, but well, that's different. Okay. Let me see. I do score this one and get one extra victory point for the card that I didn't draw. <clears throat> Why is the table size so small? That's because we're playing Spearhead. It is an introductory game, uh, and we love it. It's a nine yes. out of ten. It's our favorite game. Uh, because you can get these games done in like a, an hour and a half. And so you can play like three of these in the time it takes for yeah. you to play a big game. And it has just as much tactics. It's just as fun. All the die rolls are really important. And it's very tactical. And the games are all really close. All right. So I scored one extra point because I drew one card. You trashed all your cards. Drew some more cards. Um, and yes. go. All right. So I will do my movement phase. Which will be We'll start with my Cavaliers. I'm going to move them ten inches. I want them like in this corner right there. Okay. Like that? Yeah. Um, Steel Helms can't go anywhere. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm going to move this kind of layer around. Over here. Okay. And 
this one goes with this guy. And that concludes my movement. Now we are on to the shooting phase, but I have no shooters anymore. Um, so we will do move on to charges. No yeah. charges. All right. Yeah. yeah, no charges because I'm locked in. Um, so let me go ahead and just complete. Let's do this fight right here in the middle. Okay. So that's going to be, well, no, now down to 18. So I need to do, or no, down to eight guys. So that's 16 dice. Sixteen on four ropes. Uh. All right, and I gotta hit another four ups. Oops. Yeah. Four. Four. Four, no rend. No rend, one damage. Fives. Not a single Ooh. one. So, um, uh, three die, and, or no, two die. And it says, for each slain model from this unit, make a legion roll D6. For each five plus, return one slain model. Mm -hmm. Give me a five. Give me a five. We got one five. <laughs> <laughs> that is so powerful. Oh my god! But I don't want it. I need. <laughs> I need to respawn them. The whole unit. Oh, maybe I should have fucking charged my fucking captain into them. If you know. wanted to clear it, yeah, yeah. But if you cleared it, you're just gonna get two more. Yeah. So well, I'm it's trying probably to, better. I'm trying to head towards. To uh, get all these yeah. points, yeah. So it would have backed me up anyways. Okay, so uh, I think that's it. Let's go yeah. to scoring for you. You've got, uh, give me a blue dice here. So you've got three points for three objectives. Can you score any cards? Score, I think, all three of my cards. No way. Yeah. One, <laughs> two, three, and go ahead. So we have long, long edge battle. Field, yeah, three long inches. edge battlefield. Gun. Short edge battlefield. Short. Wait a minute. Short edge. No way. The short edge, right there. You have to have them on both. It's flanks, right? What's it called? The card says if what? If you're battle tactic, then what's the name of the ability? Uh, take the flanks. Yeah, you need uh, one on e on both sides. But you did each. score. Yeah. Yeah. You did so score the one, one within three inches of the long. Yeah, but I can if I get that guy over there. Yeah. Um, and then what's the other one? And then if you control, control, gain control of an objective without fighting. Which was here. Yeah. Okay. And that one was called what? Uh, we need to read take, the abilities. Sorry. Take without warning. Okay. Take without warning and raise. Got it. Turn those cards in. And that is the end of uh, turn uh, two. And uh, we will be going into... So you just took the lead with one point. So it is Patrick 10, Joe 9. Going into turn three. Uh-oh. Yeah. You know what that means. <clears throat> That's when my Vargas is show up. Yeah. Um, my time has run out. <laughs> your time has run out. <laughs> but you know what's really important? Priority. Yeah. Because if, if you get priority, and then you can do stuff. Yeah. Uh, beforehand. So I really I, wish I would have gotten rid priority. of those guys in the fucking middle. Though. Yeah. Well. I wish you would have too, because then I can bring <laughs> both my units on. on. Oh, ah, Patrick, no. you what done is going fucked on? it up. <laughs> I can still fuck it up. If I roll a one, I think you automatically win. Uh, it's uh, not a one. It's, not it's a three. <laughs> yeah. Gold Soul, soul Blight Grave Lords. Oh, I didn't do my end of turn <coughs> where I where I throw for D three slain models. Go ahead and do it. We want you at your maximum power. Uh, it's only one. So, okay, here is the new <sighs> twist for the turn. It is mount the attack. One extra victory point at the end of their turn for each objective they control that was controlled by their opponent at the start of their turn. 
In addition, the underdog picks one friendly unit to be the spearhead. That unit have plus one charge. It has charge plus one damage. This is going to need an FAQ because my uh, cavalry already have a plus one damage on charge. Can it stack? Can it stack? Hmm. So I'll, I'll ask them about that. Right. Interesting. All right, we're about an hour out. Okay, yeah. Two this is only a four-turn four game, so it, it will uh, it'll, it'll wrap up before the game for sure. All right, do you need any cards? Yeah, I need two. All right, take two. I'm going to see if I want to discard Not anything. Hey. I'm gonna discard this 500 one. bitties from Sparky. Hey, Sparky, I wish you good luck with your Cowboys today, but I can't. Go, Browns! <laughs> oh, son of a bitch. He <laughs> wheeled us in. Yeah, he baited us. And then he got us. Baited us. Hey, man, I honestly think you're going to win. So yeah, I predicted killer that you would win by 10 points. I said Patrick seven. said you would win by seven. So, uh, there's one more cowboy fan in this house. We need to ask him. Yeah. <laughs> Devin! Devin! How many points are the cowboys going to win or lose by today? I can't believe you came on my mom. <laughs> what <laughs> what I'm talking to you. Six what? We'll win by six? Oh, Devin, Devin says <laughs> we will win by six. So you got the opinion of the other cowboy fan. Dr. Evil. Dr. Evil What's is up, over man? here. Oh, he's bringing a smile to my face, bro. I think I'm going to need to get rid of this card. I've never had to get rid of that card before. It was calling reinforcements. You never get rid oh, of that Oh, yeah, card. that's a... But, see, we're in turn three, and it's like, I don't think my Blood Knights will be completely dead by turn three. They might, so I might be making a huge mistake, but um, I did it. Was their resurrection... It's They're so powerful with their... The, those don't resurrect. That's the thing. So. Oh, that's your calf. Yeah. Can you do it on calf? No, they don't resurrect. No, I'm saying. Oh, can calling you, reinforcements? Yeah. yeah. It's any unit that has five or more. Okay. At the start before they were dead. Yeah. Can't do it on these guys, the VAR guys. Yeah. 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 Um, hmm. Okay. Well. They're about to turn around and beat my ass. Yeah, I'm going to turn around <laughs> and beat your ass. But it's like I don't really care about your soldiers. Yeah. So I'm going to move on. Let's see. So I, I do have an ability. Endless legions once per battle. Pick a friendly death skeletons unit that has been destroyed. You can set up a replacement unit with D6 plus four models. See, I wanted you to destroy that because when I use this. Bring them back up. It, it, I have to do both, or I only get one. It's only once per battle. So oh, you want both of your both units your, to be wiped so you can that bring you can both bring back. both your units back. So by not killing him, by him being a stubborn asshole, <laughs> it actually hurt me. <laughs> so the one time the, the reanimation time thing hurt, hurt you. me is yeah. now. And then more than six inches from all enemy units. Um, yeah, all right. So I'm going to res my uh, death rattle. Once per battle, I'm using Endless Legions. Si uh, ooh, oh, six plus four. That's my. full ten. That's a full, that's a full stack. stack. And they just need to be board. six inches away. Uh, what is the control score of each one of these guys? They have a control of only one. Only one. Yep. Okay. Um, I'm going to put them here. But if I put them here, they have to stay there, and then they won't get to do anything. That might not be cool. Um, hmm. 
<clears throat> Shit. It would be a six inch charge to tie anything else up. I think it's probably smarter if I just six inch charge them and tie these guys up again. Yeah. Just got out of it. I know you just got out of it. That's why now I'm going to do it. Back into it. We're going to go six inches away from everyone. And do a six inch charge into them. So these skeletons rise from the grave. Okay. And now. Oh, so did someone hit the dice cam here? Uh, I think maybe I did. I did. Okay. Thank you. I'm surprised I did. Um, <laughs> never hit it. Yeah. Might have been. No, it might have been. <laughs> All right. Uh, sure. Let's go with the uh, uh, cavalry here. We're going to go 10 inches here. No. Yeah. I'm going to stay, stay away, away from And me. make this three inches. That's about three inches away there. Okay, grab it. Okay. Just blocking my path. And what I'm trying to do, so I move the Blood Knights from here to here, trying to come after your general. And I'm so. And then the Vampirella. Is gonna move six inches here. <laughs> I like your move, but naked by yourself. <laughs> Some clarity. Are you naked? <laughs> if you're naked, well, a lot of people are gonna say no. I'm not naked, so we're not gonna make any sales. Uh, but it gets the lulls. It does get the lulls. I, I've never you seen approve that. of yeah, the lulls. I love it. Love it. Great, All right, so we great have marketing. we have some interest. We have some important charges to make. Let's make six inches. Actually, let's do the most important one over here. Yeah. Let's do a three inch charge. Uh -oh. Blood Knights into your once, general once, who is exploded. One, one, one. No. no. So they are in. That's my purse. I don't know you. Get away from me. Dang it. Okay. Ooh, that's going to hurt. Yeah. And let's actually, fuck it. Let's put Vampirella into your Skellies. your squad here. So that's a, it's a five or a six. Ooh. Got a seven. She's in. How are you getting those analytics, Dr. Evil? Said you'd be interested in Twitch analytics showing number of people watching, I'm watching the stream nude. I don't know how he gets those <laughs> analytics. You know. um, no. And then this one was the uh, six inch yeah. charge. And this is actually the most important when one. When did the Varguses come in? Uh, they come in now. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Uh, they come in now. So those I just changed their name completely to the Varguses. Are the Varguses. <laughs> yes, please. Uh, six inches away, they swoop down. Uh, so we'll use them here. Yeah, what you wanted to do earlier, right? Yeah. yeah. That's smart. And I'm swooping them down here because they move really fast all across the battlefield, but I'm going to have to let them stay there, so unfortunately, to score. To score. Yeah. Um, all right, so six-inch charge right here. This is the important one. <gasps> it's a failure. Oh, Wow, but luckily I a have a card son of a bitch. that is going to let me re-roll no. that. But I'm losing out. I do have this, yeah, and I'm losing out on it on that point. Oh, that point and yeah. it's like I'm down by one point. So this is really, really risky to do because <laughs> if I don't get this on this re-roll, then it will have wasted it completely. Oh, oh you got it. Because this will stop me from going anywhere. This will stop you from charging yeah. and, and moving. Yeah. Oh, got the charge. There we go. Oh, 
All right. Well, this is going to be an epic turn three. I, I think I think we've got this. So full blood knight charge into your general. Uh, let's do 15 dice. 15 dice. Oh, no. Threes and threes. This is yeah, seven charge health. Charge plus one. Now, we don't know if this shit stacks. Yeah. So because we don't know if it stacks... I'll do the plus one damage on the skeletons, okay? All right. As the spearhead. Okay. So here we go. Threes and threes. Mm, not a good roll. Still only threes. Not a good roll. Uh, and then threes. Oh, no. I lost a lot of the combat power. See, this is wild. My blood knights never roll as well as I think they can. So on only three. four hits at rend one. Rend one. Mm -hmm. uh, how many damage are there? One. Uh, well, it's two damage now two damage? because they charged. Okay. Four uh, at rend one. I'm gonna use my flipped card. What is that? It's the uh, one I held. It did the. Uh, yep. It's for. Um, it's called Steel Defense, and it's used by a friendly unit targeted by an attack. Yeah. The effect is ignore the Rin characteristics of the attack oh, this phase. Nice. So I'm hoping to keep so this four, guy alive. Four with wounds that. at no Ren. No Ren, yeah. So I'm hoping to keep him alive here. That'll probably help. Four wounds. So this will be a straight up three up save. Only threes. Damn, dude. Still <laughs> two went through. Two went through. Ugh. And you get uh, four damage. Oh. How much health does he have? Uh, he has seven. He has seven? The general? Yeah, general. Yeah. Seven. So uh, four health. So he's got three health left. Well, let's see if the horsey's hooves <laughs> and teeth can get him. I don't think so. But stranger things have happened. Uh, I need fives and threes. Uh -oh. It looks like a good <laughs> roll, but fives are damn near impossible. Yeah, it's only five, four. it's only four, and then threes. Uh, two wounds at no rin, right. and plus you still have that power. Yeah, so it's it's three up, two threes. Damn it, dude. So one, one more damage through, yeah. on him. So he's at five. five. He's two away. So he's two away from dying. That's all I've got, though. So he successfully took a Blood Knight charge. Yeah, I was trying to keep him alive. I wish the Blood Knight hit harder, but I'm going to have to just deal with the fact that they don't. Man, I did do a bad roll, though. And I used my little card and everything. And you yeah. used your card. Yeah, all right, trying. where are you going next? Um... Yeah, I kind of want to do that, but also I kind of want to hit Vampirella. You can hit Vampirella. <sighs> but she has really good save. Let me go ahead and go with the, the Cav. Okay. Um, still at full strength with them. Yeah. So that's 15, 15 four ups. Fifteen four ups. We're looking. Four. Four. Ups. Oh, man. All right, not too shabby. And then need four ups again. All right, so let's see if my cat can do something. Mm, hey, it's a lot. That's, that's not too shabby. That's two, four, six, eight. Eight at uh, rend one, damage one. Okay. Uh, rend one, that means they save on sixes. <laughs> <laughs> Not a single <laughs> six. So eight guys die, and then fives to resurrect them. Only two resurrections, so six guys are dead. That's okay. They're doing their job of tying you up. Four, yeah, six, eight. That's what I want. I want to be free. 
Let me be free. Oh, but you still have the horsey foot hooves. Yeah, that's where I'm going next. Let's see if the horsies can finish off. So this is going to be... They, it's hard to hit with these hooves, though. It's fucking yeah, two, it two attacks each, five ups. Yeah, five ups. So ten, five ups. Is but what then, I mean. because the hooves hit so hard, it's they're threes. threes. Yeah. So if I can get past these fives, let's see. Oh, no. Oh. No, I didn't paint these models. Oh. I would love to take credit for painting these models oh. because these are amazing oh looking. Oh, my God. It's so bad. <laughs> two. Only two hit. Yeah, yeah. two, three ups. It has a companion ability. I don't know what the fuck that no, is. No, that's just uh, you can attack with those as well. Okay. Because uh, normally you have to choose one attack line. Yeah, the, the campaign. So two hits yeah. uh, and no rend, no fives to save. Don't like spinners. Get rid of that. Okay, two more zombies or two more skeletons are dead, Three resurrecting fives. on fives. <gasps> yeah! No resurrections. <laughs> oh, two skellies still live. Damn it, I'm still tied job. up, though. <laughs> Shit. Hey, hey, yeah. hey. All right, your turn. Oh, okay, my turn. Uh, Vampirella is attacking. Yeah. And she is giving it all she's got with Steel Hills. five attacks. Now, I don't want to kill them. <laughs> you know what I mean? Because then you'll respawn a unit. So I just want to <laughs> suck their blood a little bit. And she goes three and three. Okay. That one is. Okay. Uh, uh, three hits. Okay. Uh, rend one, damage two. It's not good. That's eight people that would die yeah. if you fail all of them. Um, rend one. I'm trying to decide if I want to want to use this again. Hold on. Okay. Not in combat. Um. All right, I'm gonna. I bought them painted. Uh, I'm gonna, you know, since I run the Angry Joe show, I don't have time to paint. <laughs> I'm gonna go steel defense again. Um, I won't be able to score it, but the uh, thing is, I have to be wholly within without being in combat, and I'm in combat everywhere. Okay, what's that do? So that will take off the rent right there. Okay, so, so no, no rent. So it'll be three. Or wait, how many damage? I hit you. I wounded you three times. Yeah, three. So now it's three. Four ups. Okay, three, four ups. Instead of five ups. Yes. Alright. You got two, two block two. I would, yeah, I would have. And you take two damage. So two guys are gone. Good, that's what I wanted. <laughs> I don't know why you're buffing them, a reinforcement unit. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, you're right. I don't know. I feel like I have to do everything I can to stay alive right now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe not the smartest card burning, but uh, I couldn't really play it. So. You still hold the objective. What would have happened if you didn't do that is I would have took the objective. So it's probably smarter than I think because you can't retain that objective. Yep. All right. Well, that is the end. No, th has this guy fought back? Uh, I don't know. No, he has so. not fought back. He has not. So we will go. Uh, I can do... All of my guns, right? Since you can shoot in combat. Shoot in combat, but that's only on your turn in your shooting phase. Oh, okay. Yeah. Good to know. Well, then I will be only going with my melee weapons. Five attacks, three ups for the Master Forge Longsword. Not great. I got three of them, though. So now we got to have a four up. Four ups? Yep. No! Not a single one. Why? God damn. I do have my horses. Horses. So two five ups. Nope. Wow. Not great. Good rolling, Pat. All right. Well, <laughs> time to score. Pat then. wins the worst roll offs, Samurai Queen. Yeah, get rid That's of your dice over there. Put one of mine on. Mm -hmm. uh, and I would have gotten that one, but you actually killed enough people where you still retain it. So it's uh, three points for me. One, two, three. Uh, and I needed to capture this skull one. I didn't do it. And you complete this if the enemy general was slain. And I didn't do yeah, it. I stayed alive. You <laughs> might be able to win on points alone. If I wasn't tied up, man, I can't. I can't. You might win on points. 
because it's uh, it's your turn. Your turn three now. Yeah. Gotta make something happen though. Damn. Yeah. It's gonna come down to the wire. Thought my grave lords were a little better, but they're not. <laughs> maybe I didn't use. Maybe I just roll real bad. Okay. So. The hero phase. It is a game about points. Instead of just brawling. And I think I've just been brawling like a motherfucker. Ah, <sighs> shit. So. Oh, they have to not be in combat for me to resurrect them. So I can't do that. There's four game turns. It's you still got one one of these left. All right. Okay, so hold on. Let me. I forgot. Oh, Let me summary. Turn summary yeah. Okay. At the end. Uh, at the. Uh, okay. So blight grave lords turn three. I resurrected a bunch of skellies. Uh, charged in here. Hit the charge. And then tied these guys up and was hoping to uh, score that one. Unfortunately, he wrecked them and brought them down to two. However, they're still tied up, so I'm happy there. Uh, over here, the general took a full Blood Knight charge and managed to stay alive with two health left. So that was big there. And then my Vargas, Vargases showed up <laughs> at uh, the beginning of turn three, taking that point away from them, looking to contribute in the final turn. Uh, Vampirella decided to charge into the soldiers, uh, not wanting to kill them all. Uh, but Patrick buffed the soldiers, and uh, because of that, we only killed two of them. So he's doing his best to hold that middle point, which if he didn't do that, then I probably would have flipped the middle point. So the middle point was still his. And yeah, so Patrick was in danger of having all the points uh, flipped and being in real danger, but he's held out on those uh, two. So we will see what happens in uh, Cities of Sigmar turn three. Go ahead. All right. So everybody's tied up, so I can't really move. Um, well, I need to look at my hero face first. Hold on. Yep. You are still within range to resurrect people, right? Is that what your hero is or not? But I have to not be in combat. Oh, you're in combat. Yeah, which sucks. <laughs> um... See if I want to play this card or not. I need to score points though. If I, it's pretty much suicide if I try to retreat right here, right? No, n no, uh, retreating only results. Well, I don't know. It's results in how much damage? Let's see. Um, Retreat. Retreat. D3, D3 mortal on that unit. So between one and three health. <laughs> he only if has you can handle two between health. one and three health. But then if you retreat, you cannot uh, uh, end its move. That Munich can move through. Okay. So... But you can't charge after you retreat. You can't. Um, Can I run? No. Because run is instead of retreat. Either or. Does that count as my movement, too? I don't get a and normal move. You can't move. shoot. Do I get a normal move after I retreat, or is that. No, that is counts as your move. That's my move. It's, li it's literally the only thing you can do. If you retreat, you can't shoot and you can't charge. Yeah. And you use the retreat as your move, so you can't move. Basically, that's all you do. <laughs> Where, how far can it, but it up to his movement value? Okay, and I can go through combat. Yeah, I think so. It says retreat unit can move through combat ranges of enemy units, but cannot end that move within uh, a unit's combat range. So you have to stay outside of three inches. So you could go all you could go all the way over here. Yeah, let me try it. Okay. <laughs> so take D3 mortal damage right away. Uh, if you roll a two or a three, I'm he's dead. dead. 
<laughs> <laughs> all or nothing, baby. It's all or nothing. Let's go. Yes! <laughs> you son of a bitch. Yes! You made it through. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay. All right. Um, so that takes... Right there. Patrick, scoring points. <laughs> Just Desperately, which is smart. Just trying everything I can. Because uh, you're not going to win on combat no, power. No, I'm not. So, that, so you getting a point out of that was actually intelligent. Um, so, yeah, that's that's it for my movement phase because no one else can move. Yeah. Um, so we'll go into charging, which we're already locked up. So we go into combat. Mm -hmm. um, let me make sure I don't have anything I can. No. Yeah. All right. Let's. Let's. Uh, what do you want to fight first? Yeah, that's the question. Let me go ahead and fight first here. Okay. And uh, what are you going to put it in? Um, you have to put... Because <laughs> uh, anything within three inches of her... So I, I only have one guy left on I'll, that I'll other give, side. I'll give all of you. All of them can go into her all if right. you want. Yeah, I'll, I'll take that. Uh, so that's we're down to seven now over there. That's 14 dice. Let's see if Vampirella can sustain a f f an attack from seven men. <laughs> Get your brain out of the gutter, Jack. Hey. Grow up. Um, all right, so it's going to be 14 dice on four ups. Ugh. Not fucking great y'all so it's only five thank so you dirt twerp we're gonna try Sweet to get Leander, you. five four ups here yeah Ugh. is that so only two it's only two man wow no run good no uh, no run she has a save of three up <laughs> pink Oh, one went through. <laughs> so she took one damage. Uh, yeah, she's on the board for one damage, finally. <laughs> yeah. That's why I was like, should I just kill the other guys? But that's what you want. Yeah. Well, no, I guess that part's already I done. Do. No, I, I want it because in turn four, I can bring back that. No, that part's already done. Yeah. yeah. Um, all right. Well, I guess these two uh, skellies will hit your <laughs> cavalry before they're dead. Oh, wow, that's a cool... What the hell is that? That's really cool, <laughs> sweet Oleander. What is that? So there's fours and fours. Big emojis. Large Nothing. Emojis. Ooh, it's on you. Um, Just so go with... Fight back we'll here. say that. We'll say that these guys die, and right? We're gonna but fives. we're going to roll the fives. <laughs> One. <laughs> yeah. I never can get rid of all of them. Yeah. What you'll have to do, I mean, yeah. That's wild. It ties me up it and it drives up. me crazy. Yeah. God I'm thinking, it. Is there anything that you can do to prevent that? No. No. You could retreat, but then what does that do? You D3, can't charge. Yeah. You can't fire. Yeah. You can't fight. So. It leaves me a sitting duck. Yeah. It, it, you, you feel vulnerable because these scallies are just like. <laughs> And then they just come back. Yeah, that one MVP Rambo yeah. Skelly right there. I'm like, stay dead. I'm just fucking smashing the is ground. Is holding them down because you know what's coming next is the Blood Knights are going to smash into your yep. knights. But before that, that is the end of turn four. Um, the end of your turn three, I mean. Uh, so what do you score? Um, you score this one. You yeah. score this one. And you score this one. So you might win on points. So that's three points to you. So you go to 13, which is now. Do I have now three inches to the battle edge? No. you. Well, if we go 10 here, which was the legal limit is actually like right here is what you would have made. Okay. And then three is right here. So you would have missed it. Yeah. I didn't think I was going to get there. Yeah. Uh, is that but it? But I got the point, though. You did get the point. Um, Hold on. And oh, if you get priority, you might be able to do something. I would have gotten this one. What? If it wasn't for your goddamn resurrection. 
Um, it was, you can play this battle tactic at the end of your turn. If any enemy units were destroyed this turn, um, and more enemy units than friendly units were destroyed. Wow, yeah. The, I just realized that the resurrection turns off a lot, a lot of those of cards. cards. You know, Dude, you like, there's yeah. a secret power of the vampires that... So you that totally works. blocked me with the, the one motherfucker. Yeah. Because you, 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 could you imagine if you like scored like th <laughs> like five or six points this time? That yeah. Would, that's what you need. Oh my God. All right. Well, yeah, we're going into really turn need. four. Let's roll for priority mm -hmm. and see if maybe you can get the priority. Oh, oh, four. Well, that's pretty solid. If I want to get into Warrior My Minis, is it better to do 40K or Old World? I, I actually, there's a third choice. Old World is the one that's the rank and file. You want to do Age of Sigmar, Sigmar. which is 40K, which but is simpler. Yeah. And that's what we're playing right now. And this is the beginner's mode. I wouldn't call it a beginner's mode. I just call it a skirmish, skirmish mode, yeah. mode in Age of Sigmar. And it's a 9 out of 10. And it's going to be the cheapest yeah. to buy and cheapest Great to get into. Great introductory set. Yeah. So, and you just go to your local store and pick up a spearhead box. And the rules are free. Are afraid. you kidding me? No <laughs> way. <laughs> no way. Oh, uh, story of my life. But even if uh, you won, I think I'm, well, I don't know. It, w I, it would be close. So I have to take it because I don't want to lose. <laughs> yeah. It's close, man. It is close. So um, movement phase. Let's move these Vargeists. Oh, the fact that this guy with one <laughs> health stayed alive is really annoying. And managed to because I, I need to either take a full charge <laughs> into him just to kill him. You know, for that one hit for point. For one hit point. That's so <laughs> annoying. I think what I'm going to actually do Send is I'm going to retreat with her. And I wanted you to kill this one because then I could have spawned the 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 skelly somewhere. Hey out. man, oh, no, I no, no, wanted that was to kill out. that one because I could have yeah, scored yeah. points. You're right. No, no, <laughs> that was way worse for you than it was for me. Yeah. Do you want any cards? Uh, uh yeah. Well, I need to. Okay, I, I think need I to grab need to. One. I'm gonna dump this card. No, I think I should keep this card. Yeah, I'm gonna draw one card. Yeah, I think I'm gonna burn this one and draw this one. Oh, I I wasn't able to get a good card. That's gonna be hard. If you can somehow get six points at the end of your turn, then you might if you end with nineteen points, I don't know if I can reach nineteen. The most I can score was what, six? And I got shitty cards. Six, seven, eight. The most I can end with is 18. I gotta get this wrong. Yeah, go ahead. Um, so if we're going for points, I think I need to. I think I need to retreat with Vampirella. Bring Vampirella. Oh, but she can't charge if she retreats. I can't believe it, but I think I need to put all of these into the, him. And then bring the Vargeists around and slam them into the these. Yeah. And then if Vampirella can suck all their blood and kill these humans, then I think I can cap that. Yeah. All right, that would get me three points. Uh, I can do tank to flint. I won't be able to do that one. And slain. So, Chad, I think I could get five total, which is going to give me 17. So... If he gets four points next turn, then he ties me. If he gets five, he wins. The most I can get is five. Wow. 
See, it's still close, even though like I'm whooping his ass. Uh, I think what I should have done a long time ago was charge. It's gonna be close, Benjamin. Yeah, I feel like it's yeah. very close. Cause I, I think I can only do five points. I think you have me though. It's gonna be like either a tie or by one. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so I have to do some clever. Units. I have to do some clever bullshit. Uh, so here's the clever bullshit. Um, you, I actually have to take this guy out. How yeah. annoying is that? Yeah. Is these guys can move at ten inches, so they're gonna move. That's what I was afraid of, though, because yeah. I need these points <laughs> so bad. And we're staying outside of three. Conga line. <laughs> yeah. And the reason why I'm doing this is I need to get within three inches of the edge. And uh, so when I charge, I'm just going to swing my base out to get that. Min maxing which is, over here. Which is damn near <laughs> cheating. I, I want to ref. I'm, I'm curious. I, see, I, that's to like see I said, if, uh, you know. That's what it's I was saying earlier. It's casual. So I'm, 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 a, you know, I'm down. Yeah. It's casual competitive. Casual competitive, yeah. <laughs> uh, and then the Vargites are going to go. Can you leave these guys go 12? Oh, and wow. They also have fly. Fly, yeah. So they're so they pretty much, over. it's just a three inch charge on you. Yeah. Dang it. You just have more units than me, so I can't. Yeah. Uh, at first, I was thinking about taking Vampirella off, taking the mortals and attacking him and having these guys. Yeah. But remember, if she retreats, she can't charge. So. Oh, yeah. See, yeah. that's what I was thinking. I was thinking that you're going to go off. She was going to take him out. The you thought that, too. I thought calf. that, too. And I was like, I got this wrapped up. Yeah. But that but one move from him was actually pretty the pro. Retreat. Now, before, actually, before I did all this movement, I, I do want to fire off her vile transference. You hear that, I chat? I had a pro move. A six plus. I got it with a seven. What does it do? It does. Uh, roll the number of dice equal to the target's health characteristic. You have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. That's what it is. Shit. For each five plus, inflict one mortal damage. What? That's killing them. Right? Five. I only got one. <laughs> So one mortal damage on them. You don't have a ward save. And she gets healed for every point of damage that I do. That's fun. That's, That's like she's really like, fun. That's very vampire. Yeah, it's like she's sucking my blood out. Yeah. Suck me, Vampirella. Suck me. Yeah. <laughs> I, I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't mind either. <laughs> so she's fully healed. And that was all of the uh, abilities. Then we move. Then we shoot. There's no shooting. So now we just charge. We need three-inch charges everywhere. So the super important one is this one for points. So, so as long as I don't roll a double one, I should be able to get a point. Double one. Oh, scary. Uh, <laughs> See, now, because Ooh. that's 11, 11 inches, I can all the pretty way around. much just, yeah, yeah, go here. Completely flank me. Yeah. Flank him from behind. Well. And you might as well count him as dead. Yeah, I'm about to say, you can just take him off the board, probably. And then when, and you'll have to t let me know if I can do that. Because let's say, see, I think it's like if you're going to the closest point on that of the uh, base, it would be here. And then I swing out my, my butt here. And then that's within three, three. inches yeah, of the, his base. So that's how I'm achieving that. Okay. Yeah, you, and then, you moved with, with uh, Conviction, meaning. Yeah, meaning and conviction. Yeah, you, now, the Varguses, don't roll a snake eyes. <laughs> oh, oh, four. That was, oh, that was close. That was close. That was close. Varguses are no, in. Oh, leave me alone. So, because uh, we know that the, the general is dead. Yeah. Uh, he's let's go the Vargeists first. Okay. Because I don't believe your soldiers can kill Vampirella. 
So the Vargeists uh, have the Scent of Gore. Add one rune rolls to attacks made by this unit that target a damaged unit. <gasps> You're damaged. They sense your blood. Add one to the wound rolls. So they hit uh -oh. on fours, and they normally wound on threes, but now they wound on twos. twos? Now that is powerful. where they're powerful. That's yeah. very powerful. And then they do have an ability, crit equals two hits on a six. So three attacks each. Not too many attacks. There's only nine coming at you. Let's see if we can roll any sixes. There is one six. And then we're looking for fours on that first one that's hard. Oh, now two. Twos. Because you This you're is going to tear into me. Ah! 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 <laughs> <laughs> so uh, this was a two, three, four, five, six. Six uh, wounds. Is it Rend one. Damage oh, two. Oh, my They God. are. Okay, I'll give it to you. They're powerful. <laughs> 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 if they hit you first. All right, so six, Ren one, damage two, fuck. Yeah, All right, I have three ups, one. so four ups. Four so I ups. need six four ups. Six four ups. Show me six four ups, baby. Come on. Oh, no. Hey, half, three blocks. Half went through, though. So that's that's six, six damage. damage. Damn. And so they're but that's all they got. They don't have anything else in that. So six damage. So you This guy had one health left. Yeah. So it's uh, it's two guys down, one guy with, with one a health. Two. Yeah, with a two. Yeah. Uh, uh, right? Yeah. Yeah, six two guys six. down and then one, one guy with, with a one left health left. Yeah. Oh no! See, well, shit. You, I thought that they'd be a little more effective than that, but with a first charge, eh? Yeah, it's all right. How much control do they have? Only one a piece. Okay. I'm so saying. right now, I think you're still winning. You're tight because these are two each. The Cavaliers are only one control. Oh, now I'm winning because there's one skeleton left. Oh no! You forgot the skeleton. Yeah. Kill but him. you fight back. Yeah. You can kill him. Yeah. Um, let me fight back with my skeletons first. Okay. Over here. All right. Wait. Maybe. <laughs> maybe I should give one more, one last. Uh, one last hurrah. Hurrah mm -hmm. over there. I don't want Vampirella hitting me though. So. Uh, I mean, she probably won't take him out either though. I feel like either of these fights I'm fucked in. Um, but I know he's going for sure, so let me go here. Um, I'm down to six on here, so that's only 12 dice this time, so I'm doing 12 four ups. All right, we need some good rolls. We need lots of fours. No, not quite. Oh, not quite. Oh, geez, man. Not great. So only four. Let's try to get four ups here. Oh, my God. So bad. <laughs> Getting one, one damage, no rend. And, yeah, one wound. Sorry, one damage. No Blocked. <laughs> No, don't play the sound. <laughs> God damn it. Uh, well, um, let's see. I guess we'll kill. There, There is an infinitesimal chance that my one skelly can kill your... Uh, can knock that last wound off this guy oh, yeah. and turn you to a two control. Mm -hmm. I need a four. Oof, Nothing. Nice. All right, your turn. All right. Um, let me go ahead and swing back to the Cavaliers then. Okay. You and you can split up your attacks. Tell me what is going into what. Um, since now that I'm attacking, I can shoot. What? Is that how it goes? Yeah. No. Oh, you want to yeah. do here? Yeah. yeah. He can shoot his pistol. Oh, wait. No. See, 
it's um it's not his turn yet. In order to oh. shoot, you need to be in the shooting phase, and phase. it's not your shooting right. phase. Okay, it's that keeps confusing me. Combat I'm phase. Thinking when it's my turn. Yeah. All right, so uh, we'll just two the longsword, five three ups. Yep. And then we have to hit four ups this time. Jeez. Three, four ups. Let's see it. Two. Two at one rend. One rend. My save of three goes to four. Oh, failed two both of them. Two damage. And one of the knights already had two damage on him. Uh, and they only have one damage each. So two damage kills one and then puts one health on another one. It's just kind of... Oh, I guess I get to do my hooves. Hoovesies. Yeah. Uh, two five-ups. Pink. Mm, nothing. Bah! Throwing dice everywhere. Uh, all right. It's, do you hit with um, Vampirella now? I'll hit with Vampirella. These guys are going to kill you. I might as well just say that they're going to kill you. Yeah. But I'm going to hit with Vampirella. Oh no, Vampirella hits on threes, wounds on threes. She only got two, but Ren won two damage each. Oh man. So, alright. So, Ren won, that's five, five ups. Ah, both go through. Four damage, she kills four guys. I think that loses me control. It does. Nice job, Vampirella. Uh, your turn. Uh, Cav, I think, is the only thing left for me. Yeah, Cav is the only thing left, and you're going to need to split the attacks. Tell me who you're splitting between the Skelly and yeah, the... Yeah, so... I'm gonna. I'm just going to do two of the Cav into the Vargas's and one of the Cav into the Skelly. Got it. So we'll start with Skelly first. Yeah. Uh, three hits, four ups... Ooh, uh-oh. <gasps> Am I going to regret this? I got to hit a four up here. Ah, oh, let me see if my hoops hit. Uh-oh. Five up, two attacks, five up. One. Got to hit a three, three. up. <laughs> <laughs> God damn it. God why damn. is it up to cover the shit? Uh, Let's go. Yeah. Ah, <laughs> son of a bitch. <laughs> Woo. Uh, but it's no rend on a hoof, right? No. So he saves on a five. Ah, no. Yeah. Well, no, you get another five roll, right? Now I get to reconstruct myself on a five. I swear to God, if you hit it. Damn it! <laughs> <laughs> I swear to God, if you would have got that, dude. Oh, my God. All day. You've been getting this shit all day. Yeah. All right. All right. Put the two into yeah, the yeah. bargain. All right. So two. Bargain. So that's going to be six four ups I'm looking for. Wow, not great. I guess I got half of them. Gotta hit four up again. Oof. So that at least one went through. One rend, one damage. One rend. They have no armor. See, this is why I thought they sucked. Yeah. Because in one game, they got charged before they could do anything. They fell apart instantly. You need them to hit. But you need to hit with them first. Yes. Okay. Yeah. So that's a six to block. Oof. Woo. Close. close, but uh, how much damage? One. Uh, yeah, it's only it's run one one damage. Yeah. Okay, one damage. They have four damage each. Wow. Yeah. Really. So I don't think you're gonna kill one. <laughs> no, I don't think I am. Uh, I can try so with we the hooves. Just tie on that. Uh, I have two horses, so that's four, four five ups. One, <clears throat> one three up here. Got it. Five to block. No block. And is there a ward on them, by the way? There is a ward. I'll try a six on this previous one, mm -hmm. and then I'll try a six again now. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh got it man. On this. Saved him. Save on that ward. Well, I don't think I would have killed him either because it's three no, damage. Because yeah. uh, you would have needed three damage. Wow. Those, yeah, those dudes are. So it's you, tied up, and this point isn't going to score for you. So that was you fighting. Now it's me fighting, and it would be my skelly, which then would get the two-inch pile in, and then try to kill these guys. One wound at no rend. One wound, no wound. rend. No rend. Wound. Four up. 
Hey, gotcha, you son. <laughs> well, we still have more yeah. control because of Vampirella. Right. And then uh, you have nothing left to fight because you already fought with this guy. That and happens then, off the board. Then he's dead. Yeah, he's dead. We'll just agree. I oh. definitely agree with that. <laughs> oh, he did. He did his job though. He got out. He 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 did he his. Did do his job. He did do a pro move, pro retreat move. Now, uh, the the crazy part is that it's like, did did I score enough? Yes. Well, I got four <laughs> points, but you can't get four. Uh, points you can maximum you can score right. from objectives is only three. three. So if you look here, I go uh, from 12 to uh, 15. Can I score any cards? Yes. One of my cards was cut off the head, which is kill your general. Yep. So that's one more. And then because I'm within three inches of of each short edge. Here and here. You got the flank then I got the flanks. Yeah. And that was 17. The most I could get <laughs> was 18. And we're both right here and we're tied. So I couldn't get it. So you did a good job of cock blocking me right there at the yeah. end. So now you need four points on your turn. It's not doable. In order to uh, win. So let me do the turn summary, yeah. but I think that's it. I lost. Yeah. You lost. I Can the you? the car. I can't do it through car. The only way I'd be do it, able to do it is do it through car. Like take this objective back, and then do all three cards. I think is the only way. Where is the button that I use? Army test chats. No car, clean sponsor. And that would be summary. only. There it is. Yeah. So that would only be to tie you too. If if you if I could take this point back yeah. and then score all three cards, take that point back, score all three cards. That'd be four, and you'd tie. And okay, that, that's the best I could do. All right. Well, it looks like at the end of a Vampire uh, Soul Blight Grave Lords turn four, it is going to end in a Soul Blight victory. Uh, I charged my Blood Knights into the uh, general, uh, killing him. Uh, uh, Vampirella sucked off uh, four oh, more guys yeah. and killed them <laughs> good while time. healing herself. <laughs> <laughs> At least Patrick had a good time. Woo! And then over here, we tied basically as the Varguses crashed into the cavalry and only killed two of them. And we realized that if they cannot take a punch, but luckily they hit first. Hard. Uh, but he was not able to knock them off. So we tied there. So I was able to get uh, four which is only equals three, score two cards, and at the last minute, uh, jump ahead to 17. And on his turn, he would need four points in this situation to tie me, and it's just not going to happen. Yeah, I don't have the cards Because all he has is two infantry and three cavalry, so. And the guy Good that game. can bring back guys is dead, so. Yeah. All right, good game, good Patrick. Game. That was fun, that dude. Was fun. Yeah, that was good it's time. It's always fun yeah. with Spearhead. Yes. That's why this is a 9 out of 10 nine game. 9 out of 10, indeed. I highly recommend Love if it. you can find a friend that, that he gets a box or you get a box. Yeah. It's small. It's condensed. It's fast. It's quick. Haymakers. You can play two of these back and forth. Fun rolls. Fun rolls. Fair. Uh, close all the way yeah. to the end. Till if, the very if you would have rolled differently, if I would have rolled differently, if yeah. I would have cho chose different things. It came it down always, to a couple points. It always comes down to the wire like yeah. that. So Definitely. love it. And uh, yeah, so that's going to be it for our battle. Uh, I got a victory with my hey. mains. I was worried. I was worried there for a little bit. Dude, so. the reanimation thing is just so strong. The, yeah, the skeletons, that's yeah. cool. Like I might, if I, we play a large battle, I want to see how that would. Up. Yeah, beautiful. tie everybody yeah. up yeah. and then hit with vampires yeah. and, and, and have the bats cavalry and fucking stuff. Fucking coming in, hitting. I see how they play. Hitting on two, are wounded on twos is yeah. nuts, And man. zombie dragons, <laughs> all sorts of stuff. Yeah, that would be cool. You're, but I've actually bought a lot for the Cities of I Sigmar. I like Cities of Sigmar. They, I it's bought them uh, a tank and I bought them like this mage thing that, blo you know, fires uh, oh, cool. beams and shit. <laughs> so they're that's pretty stacked nice. too. But anyways, that's going to be it for this yeah. one. Uh, we're going to go watch our Cowboys lose now. <laughs> and we'll see you guys on the next Angry Joe Show. Bye, Bye. everybody. Okay. Um, uh, did we miss any subs or anything? I don't Let's think go so. check.
because we had the biddies. First time I've ever seen a tabletop game. It was great. The skeleton's coming back. It was hilarious. NFL <laughs> time. Thank you so much for... Uh, can yeah. you read that name in blue? It's too Yeah, d difficult. Domango 15. Domango, when your yeah. name is that dark, it's hard uh, to see. Streamers can't fucking read it. <laughs> at least not from the distance <laughs> I'm at. I'm a lot further than most streamers yeah. because I'm over here on this side of the table. But so post game summary, we did that. And then the end scene, I would create like credits or something. And the end scene would be something like this. Hey, guys, if you like that, uh, please consider subscribing to the channel, contributing to us on Patreon. Um, and, yeah, if you want to see the full battle report instead of these edited ones, uh, go check out the Angry Joe Show live channel on YouTube where you can see it in its entirety. And if you'd like to support us and help us uh, buy some some armies, uh, then you can look us up on uh, Patreon. You know, and I would do something like that at yeah. the end of yeah, yeah, have uh, a the the credits outro. in the future. Yeah, and maybe creating like a hobby fund would be cool, so that you know I don't have to take on the hundreds <laughs> of dollars cost. And then we can help with the production costs and everything. But anyways, but yeah, so that's what I would do right Thanks. here at the end. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope uh, to see you back soon. Uh, well, uh, join the hobby. Welcome to the hobby. It's so much fun. Yay. All right, bye. <laughs> All right, bye, chat. All right, see y'all later, chat. Go, go, boys. Go, cowboys. <laughs> We're going to win. <laughs> We're going to see.